What's up? All hail the shit king. Historical shit fact, His Majesty became the first Protestant king of England because the Pope wouldn't let him get a divorce. Or eat shit. Is that actually why Protest Protestantism started? I just forget. I don't really know that much about religion. Um... Hey Doug, what Yo. is the worst song you ever heard? I can't play it. Actually, uh, there's a Sonic game that has some of the worst music I've ever heard. When are we doing the testicle sock stream? I don't know what that means. Oh, you're right. This must beat. What up? When are you gonna shit yourself on stream? Well, that's the big mystery, right? Could be happening right now! It actually could happen today. My stomach feels pretty upset. More tabs! More tabs! Tabs, 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 tabs. Probably needs to be a somewhat shorter stream. Oh, wait. Maybe not. Dungeons and Dragons might be canceled. Uh... Yo, uh, not D and D. Yeah, yeah, I DM'd Dungeons and Dragons last time, or for the first time last week, and it was so fun. So, so, so fun. Unfortunately, like basketball, D&D might be canceled for one week. We will see. All right, yo, uh, hello. Welcome. Welcome back to Tabs. Oh, I gotta get the, uh, the thing together. Hold on. Hope you are well. I am well. I'm a little tired. But that's, uh, that's part of the job. I'm usually good. Once, once hobbits start blasting against reapers... I'll be good. Alrighty. Oh shit, okay. I wanna know if D&D is canceled until sex. Anyway, yo, uh, totally accurate battle simulator. Oh, just play without him? What's yeah, I guess your we could favorite do film? Um, uh, you might think I'm lame. Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. It's a really good movie. I haven't actually watched it in like 10 years. I really liked it when I watched it. Ooh. Where in the world is Parkza? I only watch your streams and give you money for divorce. Rosa, Beggle, and Parkza content. Plus the basement is nice now. Thorvolt. I'm gonna go ahead and permaban you, bud. It's a good movie. I, I feel like when I was a kid, I saw it and I was like, holy shit, this is the coolest thing ever. And then as an, an adult, when I was maybe like 18, 19, 20, I rewatched it and I was like, this is not as good as I thought, but I still love this. And it's like beautiful and the soundtrack's amazing. And my concern, the reason I haven't watched it since is I'm worried I'll like it less and less each time I watch it. But I love Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. It's probably still the best movie ever. <clears throat> I'm sure it is.
Okay. When do we get to the battles? Uh, in a sec. Sorry, I'm like kind of scatterbrained today. I was trying to take care of other stuff this morning. Um, we are doing. Let me actually pull up the code. Let's get started with things and stuff. Where are you, code? Where did you go? Any plans to stream D and D? I no. love that game. Not at all. Uh, I mean, maybe at some point in the future, but D and D for me is a fun way to hang out with my friends, and it's not something I particularly want to turn into content. Maybe. I might try something like having Twitch chat DMing is play a awesome. campaign. What campaign are you running? I'm running Curse of Strahd, which seems to be like one of the most popular ones by far. It is very fucking cool. I have spent like probably 20 hours now, like prepping and reading through everything. It is a lot of stuff. I theoretically doing like a, I'm DMing and you guys are controlling the characters. The concept of that sounds really fun. Now let's actually think about what that means in practice. How the fuck does that work? Is it you guys Hi, voting Doug. on every Here's single thing? Because that would take to forever Thanks to do anything. Love you. So maybe um, maybe we, we do that to some degree, but um, right now, no. D&D &D is something I, I'm doing because I want to catch up with friends, not because I like Remember want to DM particularly, if that makes sense. Planet Coaster? It was great. Kind of fallen off <laughs> since then. Yeah, it has, it has been a long two days. Okay, sorry, I keep getting distracted. It's, I mean, I love Dungeons & Dragons, but there's just a difference between, like, playing it with your friends for fun and trying to make it entertaining for an audience, right? Those are very different, I think. Tabs AI. Bam. There you go. Cool. Okay, I don't need the code open. All right, so... We hey, are. Chat, would you rather have cringe streams or Pog explained with food? <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not changing my mind, even if chat votes that they want explained with food instead of streaming. You should DM for other streamers. Maybe. The problem is that I don't like. I hate improv and I hate acting and I hate pretending to be somebody else. So. I don't feel like I'm a good... I would be a good dungeon master. Oh, sorry. You got hit with the ad. Well, nothing happening. Who cares? Now the pre-roll's off for a while. It's worth it. I have ads. That is okay. You will You will survive. You will get through this. Let me get a copy of this thing. Coffee drop box. Link. All right. Let me know when you're done with ads. How would people know to... Here. <laughs> You're a streamer, but you hate improv. Improv is a very broad thing. The... There's a... Uh, for people who play... Oh, they're done? Oh, okay. For people who play Dungeons & Dragons, it's like pretending to be characters... Right? And, like, having conversations where you are pretending at, to be a specific character with their, like, needs and interests and desires, that I'm not, like, good at or comfortable with, and I don't like doing. When I play in d and I don't like the part where, I don't like the parts where it's like, your character comes up and finds the magical item that they've been looking for your whole life. And I'm sitting there, and I'm like, okay, I need to pretend to be this fantasy guy who gives a shit. I can't do that. I can't pretend to give a shit. I either do give a shit or I don't. That's how my brain works. I can't act. That's not how... So, like, with stream, if I improvise on stream, which I do, that's because I've created a situation that I am excited about, and so my brain is like, oh, I want to engage with this. My excitement on stream isn't fake, right? Even though, like, I sort of, like, get myself as energized as possible, I do really genuinely care about what's going on in my streams, and that's why I don't play games I don't care about. That's why I don't just play... That's why I don't just, like, repeat old streams very often. You know what I mean? No, I'm saying I'm not a fake streamer. I mean, there's some degree of, like, I'm trying to enhance and show, like, the, the, the most entertaining parts of myself, right? It's not like I sit around playing video games and I yell and scream and I'm, you know, blaring the victory song all the time and playing laugh tracks and shit. Right, that's, that's not how it works. So, like, I set up a situation where I can bring out the parts of myself that I think are the most fun for people, but that's not, that's not acting. That's not faking it. That's just enhancing yourself. There's a difference between that and, like, Okay, thank you. That was pretty good. There's a difference between that and I'm now going to pretend to be a person 
who is not real, who does not relate to me, and then pretend, and then talk to another person who is also a pretend. I'm not good at that. It's go. It's cool. I'm just not good at it. I don't like it. Um, <clears throat> welcome. Two tabs. A lot of actors frame acting that way. Yeah, that's fair. I don't know. He admitted he's fake. Doubters win. Yeah, well, there's a prediction, right? Is Doug real or fake? Doubters win. I was fake the whole time. I'm DMing a thing called anime campaign, which instead of modifiers, is just acting in general funniness. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Dungeons and Dragons is great because you can make it whatever you want. And so for me, I'm leaning more into like items and like interesting scenarios rather than like the acting side of it. But who knows? Maybe I'll get into it. Maybe I will become an actor. Maybe I'll start faking it. <laughs> I don't know what the... Whatever. All right. So today <clears throat> we are playing Totally Accurate Battle Simulator again. This is a game where we have two teams that fight against each other for ultimate supremacy. One of the teams is going to be you guys submitting a team using $9,000. You can see the amount down there. This isn't fake. I'm just talking. This is just me. So one team is you guys, $9,000. Even my YouTube voice, when I'm like, today I'm gonna be playing GTA 5. I just say that stuff. I just like, that's not fake, that's me. That's, I, the reason I'm passionate is because I am passionate about it. I'm not faking it. I don't have like a, I don't have like a dial on my like lower back where I turn it up and I'm like, oh, oh, we gotta be energetic. All right, crank up the energy. I'm like, whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, no. It's like, I just care about things or I don't. I care about this thing. Today, one team, $9,000 redos you get to spend. And your team is going up against three randomly generated teams, one at a time, but three randomly generated teams, right? Meaning we will use this script written by the very generous Andrew Kakmarsik. I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name again, um, which is going to generate a random team costing $10,000. Now, previously on Doug Doug, when we did this tabs thing, um, on that last, on that fake show that I, that I had, and you guys totally fell for it. None of that was real last time. So on that, that, uh, that fake acting that we did, what, last week, you guys submitted teams and you fought against random teams, but they were the same cost, right? They were the same cost. So your team of 10 grand had to go up against random teams of 10 grand and beat three in a row. This time <clears throat> you're at a disadvantage. You're going to have to outsmart and outthink the robots chat. You're going to start at $9,000. The question is, with 10% less dollar dues, can you beat three random teams in a row? Substantially harder. But we aren't smart. What's going on? It says 9000 Yes. Y yes. DT Banshee, thank you very much for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you. I don't... I just said that. $9,000. Why not 10,000? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Only 9,000. I don't understand. I feel like I feel like I'm explaining this very clearly and people are confused. What is 10% of 9,000? All right, I'm going to ignore everybody who's saying things. <laughs> Let me get my acting face back on. <clears throat> Can Twitch chat take on the random fucking inputs? This is my real voice, by the way. Are you smart enough and strategic enough to take on three armies that are bigger than your own? Okay. Uh, let's get into it. So, to do this, oh, oh, let me, um, for people who are curious about the code, uh, the, the creator of this, of this code, very generously, Andrew said he, I could share it, so let me copy the link. I am going to spam it into chat. I am allowed to spam because I am the streamer. Bam, 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 bam. If you would like to download this uh, file and have it generate your own random uh, teams for Totally Accurate Battle Simulator, you are welcome to do that. Go ahead and download this piece of Python code right there. Thank you very much uh, to Kevin Hi, for creating. Duck. Sorry, oh, my God, Andrew. Do you play as a d, d when you're not a DM? I play as a divorcee. I play as a bard. I don't think divorcee is a class. Anyways, if you would like the code, uh, there's a link to, to all this stuff here. I modified his version slightly. I made it so there's a 1 in 100 chance of an all-Hobbit team, and I also just changed the amount of money at the bottom. And I think I changed the uh, max unit choice up to 7, so the team's going to have a little bit more variety. Anywho, let's, let's fuck, chat. Ahem. <clears throat> we will be doing a giveaway. Fuck in tabs. In tabs. 
We'll be doing a giveaway. I will rig it slightly towards the subscribers because I never give the subs anything. Okay. The keyword to enter this is only nine thousand dollars. Doug, if you type you that into chat, to pay Doug. It's money time. Where is my money? My gold. I gotta get dollars. it back. I'm trying money. to earn it today. If you type only nine thousand dollars into chat, you will be entered. Please, <laughs> I should have said what the reason is. Please only type this if you have a team that you would like to enter into the battlefield. We will be selecting randomly. If you want to form your team, go to this website right here. You only need to type it one time into chat. In fact, if you type it multiple times, you will not be entered anymore. This link I am currently spamming into chat. If you go to that link, it has a list of all of the different factions of Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. There are 10 in total for each one. For example, the Renaissance faction. You can see their units and you can see their costs in this column right here. So you have $9,000 in total to spend on your team. So you can choose, you can uh, whether or not you have the game, you don't even need the game. You can just look at this and just decide what you want to spend your points on. Look through this and be like, okay, I want a scarecrow. I want a I want a mammoth. Whatever you want up to $9,000 and then when it randomly selects you, if you are randomly selected, just type your team into chat. This is actual real thing by the way. If you type it into chat more than 2 times, uh, you will you, you will be removed from the list. All right. <clears throat> I am actually very interested to see what ends up working. Can we choose secret units? No, I don't want to do secret units because that's the secret units are not allowed by the random inputs and they just seem to be less balanced. So just the default factions, I feel like that is a little more interesting because you can't do like weird cheese strats. So just these core 10 factions that are here. Cool. The first contestant is... If we type it three times, are we back in? Pretty sure you're just permanently uh, kicked out if you type it multiple times. I'm a lover, not a fighter. You need to love to fight, Brendan. The first one is... No Sulk. What is your team, No Sulk? I just watched your last as tabs on YouTube today. This is my first time being here after watching hey, you welcome. on YouTube for almost three years. Welcome, Graffiti. Welcome, welcome. I don't know. Why did you type? <laughs> Why? Okay. Hey, hey, hey. The Solid, though, you win. All right? You fucking win. You won today. Everybody give him a big congratulations. Nice job. Okay. Next team. The Skrunkster. What is this? I hate it. Is that a... What are those uh things? What are, what are those DMing rodents? Fun until it turns into you babysitting a group of murder hobos who refuse to go Chinchilla. through an encounter without trying to seduce something. Yeah. So far, they last week we had one encounter. <laughs> They're supposed for anybody who's done Curse of Strahd. You spot they go and meet with a duchess, mammoths and hobbits. Good. They're supposed to meet with a duchess who tells them to go like deal with some bandits. And <laughs> instead, they started. Like, running around the Duchess's mansion, freaking everybody out, and then kidnapped her child. And then the bandits, like, kidnapped them in turn. And so the bandits took the kid. And now this kidnapped child is just on the adventure with them. So I'm gonna have to sort that out. I don't know what to do with the child. Maybe I'll give him to, uh, <laughs> to Jonitor. Alright, uh, the first team is gonna be all mammoths and hobbits. D&D &D with chat would take forever. You say that, like, D&D &D players don't have sessions that last days long. Yeah, but, like, it would really take forever, right? Like, even making a decision would take five minutes. I mean, I'll think about it. I like hey, the Doug, concept of I'm it. I'm in a family dynamics class for a social service course, and I actually had a class about divorce. I had to actively try not to laugh. <laughs> this is not a joke. You have ruined my sense of humor. <laughs> Anyways, I love your style so much, so take my money. Hey, thank you. You probably looked like a real asshole. You can't, like, you can't ex ex explain that situation. You can't be like, no, 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 divorce is really funny in this Twitch stream. Then you just look more insane. You can't salvage that at all. Th there's no way to explain what goes on here in a way that makes you not look insane. Um, what is this one? This looks cool. I want to do a new map. 
This doesn't have places where I can put hobbits. I can put hobbits way up at the top. All right, let's try it. Cool, cool, cool. So, the first contestant, Twitch chat. One, two, okay, Doug. three, Update on the trans girl testosterone four. muscle rat that works at Doug Mart. It is now attempting to build a nuclear bomb to sell in aisle 13. This is very profitable business. I knew we would make a lot of money once we got to the nuclear arms race. That's what all good businessmen teach you. <laughs> the real money's in the nuclear weapons. Um, <clears throat> chat, what do you think? Critical this is your campaign new team. Chat made live action choices and they had the campaign planned for both options or am I thinking of someone else? Uh, I have no idea. I haven't, I have not actually watched that much or listened to that much Dungeons and Dragons content because it's extremely slow and uh, a little too tedious for me. I just don't have that much time to listen to stuff. Uh, oh, right. It only works in PowerShell. One sec. Do you want the, wait, do you guys want the hobbits in the back so they come in after the mammoths are done? Or just one hobbit in the back so he comes in after the first <laughs> after the mammoths and hobbits are are done. Uh live stream python tabs python tabs at. Cool. All right, so this thing will generate teams for me. Wait, does anybody know can I uh, in, make, can I make the text on PowerShell bigger? Can you do that? Is there a way? Because I, I don't think control control plus doesn't do that. Anybody know that? Is that a thing? Yes. How do I do it? Yes, you can. Strong plus. What is S T R G? What it, is that? A key on the keyboard. Right click the top bar. Edit. No. Properties. Font. Oh. Oh, my God. Okay, that's way bigger. All right. Your first team that you're going up against <clears throat> is one Reaper, one the King, one Quick Draw. These are all really, really powerful melee units. Ten Bone Mages and eleven Fencers. I'm going to be honest. I think your team is fucked, chat. This is, uh, is going to be bad. Okay, on the right, and we will do a bet. If there's a mod around who wants to do predictions, that would be great. Um, we can just do a one minute prediction saying who wins blue uh, left or right. Otherwise, I will do them myself, that is fine. Okay, so you've got one reaper on the side. Reapers are scary. You've got one king, kings are very powerful. You've got one quick draw from Wild West. You've got 10 Bone mages, who are kind of like ranged units. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. They're pretty nuts. And then 11 fencers from the Renaissance. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then they can even get a couple hobbits in. Oops. I'll move your... Oops. I'll move your hobbit back there. Uh, okay. Do I need to put it at the bottom? Okay, I will put it at the bottom. $10,000 teams to win. So. Yes, this is literally rigged. That is the point. The whole point is that you are... Uh, is that chat has a disadvantage against the random teams. That is the entire challenge of today. You have to build a team that is so durable the it can night, build the new beat three $10,000 teams. Chat is giant dongs. Uh, again, if you want to build your own team, you can look at the units and the prices here. You're a nerd, Doug. Also, hi, chat. I'm leaving. This is unbelievable. <laughs> Sorry, I'm sorry I ruined all of your expectations. Uh, okay, F is camera. All right, y'all. I think we're good to go. I think we're fucking ready. I'm going to play some music. Let's, let's play this music. 
I'm gonna be honest, I think the blue team is fucked. Mm, let's find out. Maybe Novel Layer is a DM and chat wrote some oh, characters wait. actions. Potentially. Rennis? Okay, the, the 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 stabby guys are already dead. If they can clean out the bone mages in the back, that would be huge. Okay, they're actually mammoths are stomping through the bone mages. They've still wait, they still got a lot of fencers. The Reaper's still alive. One mammoth is dead. Two wait, no. You can tell if it's dead if it has an X over the eyes. So three mammoths are alive. Reaper and King are still here. But good news, Hobbit's coming in. Hobbit's here to save you. Wait. Red victory? Huh? Oh, the mammoths are dead. Wait. What? <laughs> Why is he dead? I don't get it. <laughs> okay. Well, it's a big fat loss Doctor for the streamer mammoth hobbit team. Pretending to be fake streamer acting like a real streamer. No, I'm real. He died standing up with a Chad. I don't understand what just happened here. I mean, to be fair, this was a very powerful random Doug team. Reapers are, are like nuts. My wife faked her orgasms before she left me. Hmm. Yeah, be sure to give us all the details. All right. Sorry, Scrugster. You got roasted. Okay, I'm going to redo this. Now that people know what's going on, if you type, I, I have a team of $9,000. If you type that into chat one time, you will be entered into the, into the giveaway. Has it all this time? The divorces? Parks has gun? The shitty timp? No. Look, if somebody acts so convincingly that you believe him, is it really acting at all? Show Think us about the that, Chad. You. Maybe I've been acting for too long, though. I've lost the essence of myself. One billion, one hundred million, eleven thousand and one here have some numbers, you freaking robot. <laughs> I don't think robots like eat numbers. Okay, the next team is Mini Gov Room. We all know that just has a lot of elaborately designed cardboard cutouts that he changes every couple seconds. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. All right, fine. I'll show you the real me. No, no, no. You already entered. What team Jesus, do you want? Take the wheel. D B. Wait, D T Banshee. Thank you very much for the ten gifted subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Chat, I'll admit it. I was acting the whole time. I'm not actually wearing this sweater. Oh, God. Ugh. I was wearing this shirt. None of it was real. Okay, do you have a team? Twitch chat, but I'm not real and I'm big, but... Jedi. Jedi's not a unit. Love the enthusiasm, though. Just the, it's we're just playing with the ten default factions that are in the game. No special units. What do you got? All right, thank you very much, Mini Gov Room. You won! Congratulations, Rigged. Silver Vader. Also, what's happening? You can't start. You can't start by saying rigged. Silver Vader, you have won. The chat is pogging their balls off. Go ahead and let us know what team you want. On subscription, cheering and gifting subs. I regret my life choices. <laughs> Yo! Thank you, DT. Appreciate it. Yo, you won! Yo, Pogs for Silver Vader! Yeah, tabs is just a, a little bonus thing. The real contest of today is do you win? And you won. Now, do you have a team for the for the bonus competition? There we go. From the back. Wait, wait, wait. You didn't tell me how many. Give us oh, your just social one? security number to prove you aren't fake. I'll assume then, you just mean one. Mr. Doug Doug. If you even go by that name anymore. If this is heads, I'll give you one number for my social security number. Fuck.
Okay, there's a four in it. Do with that what you will. Okay, Silver Raider, I got your team. Let us set it up. I'll move this over here. Front to back, Skeleton Warrior. Catapult. Where's Catapult? Medieval? Yeah. Wait, why do you want this so close? I'll move it farther back. I, don't, I assume you don't want it that close. Zeus behind them. Nine archers behind them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two knights behind them? From back to front. Did you mean from front to back? I'm following your orders, man. Wait. Uh, blue and red. Okay. Back to front. Back from back to front. Oh, I'm literally dumb. I'm misreading it. Okay, yeah. Sorry. Wait, why do you want a skeleton warrior in the back? This doesn't make sense either way. <laughs> okay. One skeleton warrior in the back. Then a catapult. Then you want Zeus. Then you want nine archers. One, two, three, Spent four, five, six, Spent 95 bucks seven, on eight. subscription, gifting subs, and cheering. I regret my life choices, but I'm sure it's worth it. It's an investment. Smile, smile. Think about all the money that'll definitely generate at some point. Two knights. Pirate queen. Pirate queen is amazing. And a cluster of hobbits. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cool. Twitch chat, here's your new army. I like it. It has actually some good variety. I think this has uh this has real potential. Nice mix of range and frontline. Pirate Queen is is super, super tanky, so she can take a bunch of stuff, and then you got knights behind with archers, Zeus. I think this is actually really solid. And your contestant is one catapult, 105 protectors, two vampires, one hay baler. This seems very beatable. I think you're actually going to go get a win. All right, predictions up. So on the right, catapult is out here. 105 protectors. I'll deal with that later. Two vampires from the spooky... Doug, do you secretly have a twin brother who is 10x more animated than you that you use on YouTube? <laughs> and you're able to switch places at will? I don't. It's me. It's been me the whole time. It's just acting. Okay, and then a bunch of protectors. I'm gonna be honest, the team on the right sucks. <laughs> These guys aren't gonna do anything. What is the point of having 105 people with shields? I mean, it'd be hilarious if I'm wrong. Oh, they also have they have space for one hobbit. I'll put him back here. No, I'll put the hobbit. Can he come up here? All right. Red team gets a hobbit way up here. The other team... <laughs> so it's, it's always going to generate two random teams. The second one it generated was 55 healers. That would have been a little bit too easy. Um, dude, I think I think this is good. I honestly think this team could win it. This could absolutely win it. Like the whole thing could win three rounds in a row. The, which, and to be clear, this is a very hard challenge to beat three random teams because the odds I are stacked against you. It is literally a video, and the amount of times they've threatened me with divorce since then has increased significantly. <laughs> also, trans rights. Uh, that sounds like a, a win overall. I think. Okay. Yeah, I think every everybody in this community is the having DMT a weirder relationship I've with the, uh, heard the, is the Dungeons divorce. and Daddies. Freddie Wong is one of the cast, and it is hilarious. Ten I've, I've heard of it. I've heard the good things about that. I've heard good things about that. D roll Dimension 20. I don't know the, remember the name of it. Dimension something. I've listened to... What is it? Adventure Zone, which I thought was very, very good, although I kind of uh, fell off of it. And there's one other. Oh, Critical Role. I tried Critical Role. I didn't get into it personally at all. But maybe I'll try again at some point. I don't know. I just don't have that much time to just like listen to podcasts, you know? Okay, <clears throat> next battle. The great army of shield men versus hobbits, pirate queen, knights, archers, catapults. Your only hope on the red side 
is that this catapult has so much time to get off shots because of the the shield men. But that rock kind of missed. Okay, they moved in. Do the protectors even attack? Do they even do damage? Wait, they are doing damage. The knights are dead. This is doable. Oh, wait, no, they still have Zeus in the back. No, never mind. Okay, the Pirate Queen's dead. Oh, wait. Oh, here's the Hobbit. Are you alive? No, you're not alive. So is it up to the catapult? It's up to this guy. He has to kill all of them right now. Yep, yeah, never mind. He died while... <laughs> he died mid-catapult throw. Oof. Brutal. All right. Yo. Strong first victory on the board. All right. I legitimately think this strategy is going to crush it. Okay, to keep it suspenseful, I'm going to not reveal the next team. Or I'm not going to build it. I'll suddenly reveal it, and that's when the prediction goes live. Okay, this, this one's going to be harder. One, two, three, four. Gunslingers. This is looking rough, guys. This is looking very rough. Can I please have my money? Yes. Um, all right, mods, if, uh, whoever just paid out the prediction, if you want to open up a new one right now. Okay, these are the two teams. On the left, your returning victor, Twitch chat. On the right, you've got four bards. These guys just run around and distract. You've got five chieftains. These are kind of mid-tier melee units. You've got a mammoth. You've got six gunslingers, mid-tier ranged units in the back. You've got bomb throwers, two mid-tier range units, and a ninja. So a, a good amount of, like, fairly strong range units and a little army of, like, tribal frontline. I really don't know. I have no clue who wins this one. This is a tough team on the right, I think. Gunslingers are hella OP. Yeah, gunslingers are rough. I'm gonna be honest. Probably... I don't know, dude. Everybody's still going hard on blue. Hold on, we got another per we got another minute. Okay, just for future ones, just do one minute predictions. I swear those gunslingers were Edward Scissor's hands. Are they? I haven't seen Edward Scissor's hands. Oh yeah, it does kind of look like that. They are holding two guns in each hand. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Calm down, calm down. Um. <clears throat> Two Reapers and four Dynamite Throwers. You are not telling me a team right now. If you are selected randomly, that is the person who decides the team. Wait, is there a Hobbit up here still? No, he's gone. Whew. The prediction is now over. Or no, it's like 10, ten more seconds. This is, seems pretty close. This is very close. I really don't know. Can I believe my... What, who, what's the... There's still way more people in blue. Really? I think blue's fucked. Now the prediction's over, I think that's a terrible bet. The hobbits will move in and distract. The mammoth is going to charge through, but that's his attack wasted on hobbits, and the pirate queen and knights can work on it. Mammoth charges in. But the hobbits are jumping to the side to dodge the attack. The gunslinger starts shooting. Hobbits are immediately shot down. Knights knocked down by Mammoth. Zeus in the back working on it. Pirate Queen can stall for a long time, though. You've got all the chieftains seemingly still alive. No, maybe just three of them. This Mammoth is a huge problem right now. Zeus! Whoa, Mammoth is dead! Okay. Archers in the back doing work. The bards. Wait, they're all dead. How's everybody dead? I think Zeus with the with the AoE attack. 
The chain attack is just ripping through the back line. Wow, that was not even remotely close. This team is insane. Man, I thought I thought blue team was super fucked. I was not even remotely close. And the pirate queen bombs. Yeah, pirate queen drops bombs. I just thought the gunslingers died so quick. I don't know. This could be the team right off the bat. Okay. I will form the final team. Let chat play 8 ball pool online. We can aim the same way that we do when we play Pago. Also, this money is for the editors. <laughs> okay, noted. That only works if they edit the video, though. Good morning, Duncan. Also, I haven't played 8-Ball. Morning, professional organ and teller. Okay, sorry. Uh, quick draw, Wild West. If Reaper oh, shows up, we just die. Dude, I don't know. This is this is an interesting one. Okay, and then you've got a little bit of extra money, so I will give them a hobbit. Okay, <clears throat> the new teams are. Wait, we need dramatic build-up music. So last time it took like four hours for you guys to beat three teams in a row that cost ten thousand dollars. Okay. Three or four hours. We might, within like 15 minutes of actually playing the game, have a team from Twitch chat fielded that can beat three teams in a row at only $9,000. Starting right now. On the left, your returning champion going for their third and final win. And on the right, hay balers up front. You've got nine hay balers up front. You have a harvester, mid tier melee unit from the farmers. You've got two kings on the back, quite durable, powerful melee units. Behind them, a pirate captain. Behind them, uh, a dead eye and a gunslinger. I believe are these two. And then, or wait, these are dead eyes. There's two dead. There's two of these snipery guys on the side. And then this is the gunslinger, and this is the dead eye. I think. No, I'm missing the names of one of them. And then in the back, you got a hobbit. Quick draw. That's it. Quick draw. So this is quick draw, right? And then these these are dead eyes, I believe. I have no idea. This is a this is a pretty beefy final team. Whew. What are people betting? Forty-five million dollar dues being put onto blue team. That much confidence. Red is terrible. Well, the hay balers soak up so much damage, right? All right. See what happens. Three. Quick draw is killer. It's, yeah, the back line's pretty beefy, dude. I could see this falling apart. The fact that you have, like, half of the money spent on the back line in guns. The hobbits jump in on the hay balers. Shots being fired out the back, but they are aiming at the hobbits. Hobbits are actually doing a good job of distracting. Catapult comes in, does connect with... Seemingly nobody. That might be a miss there. Hay balers are falling, but you have knights clashing with kings and pirate queens. Zeus connecting, but not getting... Wait. He's not connecting with the back line quite as much. If the pirate queen dies, red team... Oh. No, that's not death. She just does that. That's just her thing. It depends how quickly Zeus can take out the front. They still have... He's dead. The captain's dead. They have two kings. The kings have to stay alive. Wait, Pirate Queen is dead! Red still has all four backline gunners! 
Zeus, archers, the catapult is down! Who killed the catapult? Are you alive? This guy's stuck in the catapult. Zeus is pretty beefy though. If he can hold while the archers take out the kings, they'll be good. No, oh, Zeus is dead! But the backline was shot. You've still got archers and the skeleton warrior. He might scare them. Oh god, they're already dead. Absolutely dominant performance from that team. Oh, red team sucks. They can't do it. They fucking annihilated you, chat. <sighs> that's, a, that's a lot of money that just went to the doubters. I saw several people say they'd put their life savings into that. And now they're going to gloat. They're just going to gloat on you. Silver Vader, that was a very strong team, though. That was a very, very strong team. You're lousy. Well played. <laughs> if that team couldn't... Okay, hold on. So somebody said, if that team can't do three in a row, th this is impossible. So... <laughs> why are you laughing? Wait till there's a joke. Okay, whatever. Next person is not a bot 244. What is your team? Congratulations, you win. Okay, are we done? We're done. What I was going to say is that you are going against random teams. <laughs> They're not... They're not going to be as thoughtfully composed as your team. Some of them will be brutal, but some of them won't. That's the whole thing you gotta deal with. All right, your next contestant team. Dr. Twitch You're chat. Lousy. You can tell when there's like a huge upset in a bet because people just start blowing shitloads of money. They're so rich, they don't even care. Your fake voice is scaring me. Please bring your real one back. This is my real voice. <laughs> You're just... Hold on. <laughs> you just pick one of every... <laughs> one halfling, one farmer, one hay baler, one potion seller, Can we do one harvester... Can we do the predictions? Kazuya girl is colorblind THX. Uh, yeah, mods, if you just do left and right, that would be great. One Scarecrow, one Bard, and one Squire, and the rest are Hobbits. Why did you just stop this? <laughs> Whatever. I trust you. Um, I will just, you didn't, uh, I'll just kind of cluster some Hobbits here. The raffle this time? And some here. And here. Uh, I said it earlier, but it's, I have a team, what, what is it? I don't remember. Actually, don't say it, because you'll get booted out of the, the giveaway. Hi, Doug. I'll this repeat is your it. bank calling. Just wanted to let you know that your social security number 444444444 has been compromised. <laughs> All your assets have been frozen. <laughs> Wait, but they, how did, how did they know my secret password? 444. And the answer to my security question. How many arms and legs do you have, Doug? Dodos really like the NFT or Twitch if you think about it. <laughs> You're going up against 19 harvesters, and that's it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Activating Twitch chat place. Uh, who wins? I don't know. 
both of these teams, and I mean this respectfully, suck Mammoth Tusk. They are not very good. Fill in the Hobbits. Oh, yeah, huh? They, they get $500 more of Hobbits. I will put all of the Hobbits up here, though. I have no idea who wins this, by the way. So this is just a, a line of one of every unit. This isn't like <laughs> this isn't like a hey, Chuck, coherent this is strategy. Not a joke, so no divorce. There is a girl I like, but I don't know if she likes me back. Should I tell her? Well, if anybody can give you sound advice on relationships, it is Twitch chat. Ready. Set. Go. Oh my god, he got clothesline in the chest, dude. Stones are coming in. Bone mages are boning. Hobbits are flying. Why are these guys even in midair? What is happening? Oh, they got... Okay. Let's see what happens. Mammoth comes in. I don't know if they can take down the mammoth. He might just crush him. Wait, is he dead? Mammoth is dead. Oh my god, this is bad. Okay, but the scarecrow back here. Very powerful ranged unit. He's throwing crap at you. This guy could maybe clutch it for you. There's not that many of them left. Okay. The harvesters are really focused. What is going on here? Two almond shaped clusters of nuclei located deep in the within the temporal lobes of the brain cerebrum and complex vertebrates, including humans. Shown to perform a primary role in the processing of memory, decision making, and emotional responses. Wait, this is even. The scarecrow can pick him off. Wait, the hobbits are coming! Uh oh. The hobbits might literally clutch this for them. Usually they send many like Oh, he's focusing on the hobbit! Bits, but I just wanted to say thanks to you and your community. As you may know, I am a trans girl and I have been seeing more transphobia lately, but I am glad I can go here and feel safe to talk. Love your transgender pride. Hey, you're welcome. I am glad we can help provide a fun time for you. Um... Got fucking annihilated, hey, guys. Some guy named Nightboy is putting links in the chat. Can you please ban him? <laughs> Nightboy is a superhero. I can't ban him. Nope, oh, sorry. This team uh, didn't quite work. I appreciate the effort. Rigged, I had no potion seller. Yeah, you did. Potions were literally being thrown. Next up, Dead Skull 101. Classic what do you got? strategy. Spent over 120 bucks on this stream today. Hashtag broke. Wait, but like doll like dollars or dollar reduce? Mr. Dead Skull, are you here? Dr. Dead Skull. What do you got? You had five thousand dollars? Jeez. Go on. You know what? I think I have all the information I need. You even got space for some hobbits. Now that's a team. <laughs> this could be the one. If this is the team that wins it, I'll give 10 subs. Your contestant, 12 balloon archers, 40 firework archers, and one musketeer. You can actually Hello. beat that. I heard the winner of this competition gets a signed and framed Doug Doug dick pick. Is the dick pic prize US only? <laughs> no, I should never have brought this up. This is a terrible idea. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have zero dollars from. Eleven. 
12. 40 Firework Archers from the Dynasty. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, two 20, dogs in this house, two dogs in my mouth. Hold on, let me just put the... There's one dude back here. Okay, they also get two hobbits. I'll put him back here. T well, TS working. Yeah, it's just always really backed up at the beginning. <sighs> what do you got, chat? Can your impervious cactus team take on a literally 100% archery team? <laughs> I guess not quite 100%. You've got a guy with a gun back here and three hobbits. I believe. I hey, honestly don't. I don't know what their I'm resistance is. I'm taking your advice about usernames and using a generator to find something snappy. What do you think about the name Fertile Pecans or Poop Antlers? I mean, Poop Antlers is actually a pretty good name. It's memorable. It's funny. It's actually a good name. Like everybody here is probably gonna start. Like, look at chat. I'm gonna. I'm gonna wait three seconds till people are saying Poop Antlers. Poop Antlers Pog. Poop antlers for sure. Yeah, like people. You, so it's already going to be a, like a weird thing in chat. It's, it's a powerful name. It's got a lot of power to it. We need the Who song. Fine, I will give you the Who song for Cactus for good luck. Bagel boy, thank you so much for the twelve months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I was. I need to like move the camera around so like the text up there is against a not similarly colored background. I. There's no fucking way this works. <laughs> Ready? Guys, I just Go. the code isn't very responsive, so you have to put a hey retia moth nine thousand dollars in like ten times for it to work. <laughs> Are you dead? And they're alive! Maybe the cactus works as shields. I don't know. I don't actually know how cactuses work. This, this could be message bad. will be delayed like twenty minutes, but yes, one hundred and twenty real dollars. Send help. <laughs> Wait, the balloons aren't working! Hold on! They're like a zombie army. This is terrifying. If they get close, I think they win. They just have to. Go oh no! <laughs> oh god! They're alive! They're all still alive! They're in the back. Okay, they're getting there. They're actually making it. The catches are gonna win. Maybe they're close to dead now. Things are just exploding. I don't know what's happening. Hey, Morales, what thank you very much for twelve months. They're actually doing it, I think. Well, maybe not. There's only like three left. This could go either way. Jesus, take the wheel. They're trying to take out this. This is the musketeer, right? I think. No, this is the musketeer. If they can take him out quick. They got him. They got him. I think they win it. All the cactuses hey, might be low health, though. Getting married in December. I was wondering if you could get Pucks to officiate our divorce in January. <laughs> I'll ask him. God damn, dude. Cactus Strat took it home. That's one of three, dude. Hi, chat. I'm sorry about that last message. It wasn't true. I hope you can forgive me. Dead Skull. Interesting strategy. You are now one for three. I think I speak for everyone when I say who. Your next contestant. Actually, I will reveal it dramatically. Dude, what, what are these fucking teams you're getting? <laughs> okay, this is similar, but with a twist. This next one. Let Yourself Be Loved is the fifth studio album by German soul singer Joy Dana Lane. It was released by Nessler, the label of Dana Lane and her husband Max Herrer, in association with Vertigo Berlin and Motown Records on September 4th, 2020. Thank you. Very hey, cool. Doug, oh, I forgot to hide it. Whatever. Here are the two teams. Away literally two minutes after I joined, and I had no idea what was going on, Lemo. <laughs> I have a team now if you want. Ah, that's all right. You won. That's the important thing, that you won. It's one pirate captain, and then all skeleton archers. I don't know how you continue to get these, but um, such is how fate works. Gift subs? Did I miss gift subs? What did I miss? All in on cactus. I don't feel like it's a super great 
strategy. That last song is called Unforgiven from Tekken 5. No, I said if it wins all three. All three. If I didn't say that, that's what I meant. Has to, like, if this is the, the team that wins it all. But pooping antlers will hurt. No? I imagined it differently. Besides, I was just acting, you guys. Or wasn't I such a good actor? You believe me. I will give 10 if this wins all three. That is what I when at least meant to say. fought for solar system, the Dugtopians and Dugtopia Empire were two different factions. Yeah, that's what it seemed like. Somebody suggested that I stop using the word empire for both teams, which is a good, uh, which is a good suggestion. Jesus, take the wheel. Ah! NASA's drawing. Thank you for the gifted sub. Appreciate it. All right. I think... I think your cactus team loses this chat. I really do. I, I would love for them to get to the final round. You're currently one for hey, three. Hey, Doug, how do I know if I entered? I can't remember if I did. Could you check for me? Thanks. Uh, uh, just post again. Just post it again. I have it set that if you post it three times, then you get removed from the drawing. So just post it a second time. It's very good about just keeping you in, though. Uh, I've never seen people get booted or anything like that if for doing it once. Um... Uh, cactus time. The question, how quickly can they take out the pirate captain? Oh my god, oh my god. He shot the shit out of them. Is he dead already? He's dead already. But I think a lot of the cactuses are dead. Firework archers now shooting. Wait, no, these are skeleton archers. I think cactuses might be done. Oh, there's only... <laughs> no, dude. Oh, that's brutal. That is fucking brutal. That pirate captain. He just stalled for long enough. The skeleton archers ripped ass. They did so good, dude. Oh, rough. This poor guy. <laughs> that is hurtful. They were beautiful, Dead Skull. Here, I will redo the giveaway thing. If you type, I will not spam this twice into chat, you will be entered. Please only type this if you actually have a team ready. You have up to $9,000 to spend on your team. You can pick any of the original units. Uh, here is a link if you want to build a team of units. Just click the link that I spammed into chat just now. You can go to this page and figure out how you want to allocate your $9,000. If you spam this more than twice, you will be booted from the giveaway. Okay, I'll give it another second. Damn, that was a 50-50 bet. Interesting. Next team. S3, N6. You are up. What do you got? How do we know if we did it correctly? It's so simple. <laughs> just just put the word just put the word in and you're in. That's it. You just got to do that. It will definitely work. If you do it more than two times, you will not be in. Otherwise, you're in. How do we know? You just gotta trust me, man. You will be added to this list over here. Alright. Let's get your team set up. Two dogs in this house, two balls in my mouth. What? Okay, four gunslingers in the back. Front line, Pirate Queen on one of the flanks. Let's go Cactus Boy. One Reaper on the other. All right, pulling out the OP unit. 15 protectors in the middle? Interesting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, It's ten, Cactus, this is not Cacti, 11, also Quack. 12, 13, is it? 14, 15. Pirate Queen. Four hobbits in front of the Reaper. Okay. I can do that. One, 
two, three, four. A smooth $9,000 reduced spend. Jeffrey Ackworth Love from it. board CBEDSOMC Dale was an English first class cricketer and British Army officer. Uh -huh. Starting his military career as a non commissioned officer, he was later commissioned in June 1928. He spent the majority of his military career with the. Thank you. 20 halberds from the Renaissance. On the right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Ooh, that worked nicely. You've got um, ice archers. If you got a real mess and want to clean like the pros, then you've got to see this. Hi, Billy Mays here with Zorbies, the most absorbent material I've ever used. It has the strength and the muscle to pick up and hold over 20 ounces of liquid. Look at this. Zorbies attracts liquid like a magnet. It doesn't matter if it's coffee, soda, even red wine. Watch as its powerful vacuum action pulls and cleans the stain from out of the carpet just that quick. The secrets in the X27 X27 fiber, fiber technology, technology making Zorbies over 27 times more How do you guys have this much money? Forget I towels genuinely don't get drip. it. And unlike sponges that smell, I don't stream Zorbies enough. Zorbies is odor free and leaves a path of clean. Now you can clean and dry and never leave anything behind. You'll be amazed at just how much they absorb and they're machine washable. Dry your entire car, even your dog. Don't absorb Use the dog. any cleaner for streak-free windows. No, but like, An average family love. uses up to two rolls of paper dialogue. towels every Thank week. I do what I can. In the trash. Save money and even help save what the What I mean is like, you get two every time one of these is played, it takes like three or four hundred thousand dollar reduce. At right some now, point, you guys have to run out of money. Another five Zorbies, absolutely There's free. a finite That's amount of Zorbies. dollars Reduce, and I don't add that many and new dollar reduce every day. We'll also include our micro men microfiber duster. Wait, we free. need to do the economics it's of this. For blinds, plants, glass, and more, and attracts dust like a magnet. Wait, is he giving That's out the micro men microfiber duster? Value, all for only fourteen ninety nine. And here's you got the best ads? part. We'll send you a set of Zorbies free whenever you need them for life. Just pay shipping and processing. But you gotta call now. It is um. Doug, why did you break into my house and steal my beans? I needed those to feed to my Zorbies so they can eat my dog. No, that's not how you Zorb your dog. It's funny that people were just having the time of their fucking lives. Up and <laughs> watching an ad up until a different ad came in and then they're infuriated. Okay. Um does anybody know how many how many uh why am I bleeding? Where'd this blood come from? There's just blood there. No, I mean, not a lot of blood. There's just some blood. Whose blood the is this? Was Get this blood of off me. Ocean at the center of the Sea of Okotsk until 2014. From 1991 um, to 2014, its status was the subject of international disputes. Although since March 2014, peanut holes, seabed, and subsoil is see, legally part hole? of the... What are you talking... Okay, how many... Um, Real question. How many points... How many dollar reduce do you earn per hour? I don't actually know. What is that noise? Is it this guy? What are you doing? Why is he jittering? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna move away from the, the cocaine guy. Like 50. You make 50 points an hour? No, 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 no. Excluding predictions. I'm saying just the amount you earn by watching my stream. I'm curious how many... So, because the whole thing, right, is like there's a limited amount of dollar dues at any given point, but then each hour that I stream, a certain amount comes into the world, right? I get like 60 every once in a while. I thought you get 50 from that little gifted thing. You just earn them organically. Some people are saying 100. Some people are playing, saying 2,000. Like 250 per hour? I thought you get like 2,000. Or no, that was per day. Every five minutes get you 10 points. I'm hearing completely different numbers. I know subs get more. 120, not, not not counting gifts. Wait, what? No, we're not talking about gifts. What are you talking about? 60 every so often because of so. I wish I understood like 12. I'm hearing wildly different numbers. Is it different for everybody? Subs are saying 60 per hour. Okay, let's just assume it's 50 points an hour. So you get 50 points an hour. Um, And let's say I, I'm what? I'm streaming. Let's say f today I'll stream four hours. Let's say. 
So, that, so if we, how many people are watching? Six thousand. Okay, that's so. Each person is going to earn like two hundred points today, right? It's one hundred twenty for no subs per hour. I'm not subbed, and I get fifty. Okay, so maybe on average, if it's one hundred twenty for sub, maybe it's like seventy five on average between subs and not subs. There's not like that. It's not fifty percent subbed people in here. I don't think five points. Okay, let's say seventy five. We'll just be conservative. Uh, so this is so you earn three hundred a day. 120 per hour? Non-sub is 120 per hour. Okay, fine. I'll do 120. So you earn 480 per day, and then there are 6,700 of you. Let's assume watching through the whole stream. Okay, this explains it. So I'm injecting three... I'm printing three million two hundred thousand dollars redos into the Doug Doug ecosystem every day. Which, if you divide that by 50,000, which is the, the cost for summoning Billy Mays, or no... Divide that by 500,000, which is on average the cost for summoning Billy Mays. That means per day, I'm giving you enough dollar reduce to buy 6.4 Zorbies ads. <laughs> um, that explains things. I was literally every day I've been like, okay, this is, they're going to run out of money soon. There's no way this is sustainable. It's different for different sub tiers. Okay. Well, this is a rough estimate. Somewhere between like five and a half to maybe it's seven and a <laughs> If you got a real mess and want to clean like the pros, then you've got to see this. Hi, Billy Mays here with Zorbies, the most absorbent material I've ever used. It has the strength and the muscle to pick up and hold over 20 ounces of liquid. Look at this. Zorbies attracts liquid like a magnet. It doesn't matter if it's coffee, soda, even Can somebody water. zorb the blood off my arm? You know what? Laugh all you want, chat. That's less money for your zorbing, right? Over 27 times more absorbent than forget towels that just drip and unlike sponges. Every time you laugh, that's 0.1 less zorbing time we have to do today. There are people who have money stockpiled. Yeah, even if you stockpile, though, at some point you're going to run out. Dry your entire car. Don't zorb the dog. That's what I was thinking. I assumed everybody was blowing their savings. Average viewer earns 220 points per hour? Oh my god. Wait, so you talked about cash in the trash? Did I miss cash in the trash? Fuck. Right now, Wait. And I'll send you another another? Absolutely free. Whatever, I'm still, I still get to watch the Microman Microfiber Duster. And as a special bonus, we'll also include our The Microman Microfiber Duster! Free. It's great for blinds, plants, glass, and more. And attracts dust like a magnet. That's a $60 value, all for only $14.99. And here's the best part. We'll send you a set of Zorbies free whenever you need them for, for life. life. Just, Just pay, pay shipping, shipping and processing. processing. But, but you, you gotta, gotta call, call now. now. This is copied straight from Channel Points. Watch for five minutes, plus 10 claim special bonuses, plus participate in raid. Okay, so it's it's variable how much people earn. You know, I got a sponsorship offer for to like to play a game that I really like, and I haven't done a sponsorship in like two years, um, three if you don't count G Fuel. So, and I've never done a sponsored game, and I'm really excited about it. I'm gonna make thousands of dollars to play a game that I'm like just excited to play. Um, which I'm only say I'm only mentioning to underscore that like at this point I'm very fortunate. My stream and my channels are big enough that th company, companies are willing to, willing to pay a lot of money, like potentially thousands of dollars to play a game on stream, which is crazy, right? That's a wild thing. It's a completely insane. <laughs> Meanwhile, fucking Zorbies, by that logic, has gotten like 150 grand of free advertising. We're advertising the shit out of Zorbies every day. Dozens of times. This is absurd. Okay. The two teams are... On the left, Pirate Queen on one end, Protectors in the middle, Hobbits and Reaper on the other. It's not Raid Shadow Legends, no. It's a game I would actually play on stream. Even though I don't... Not commonly, but it's a game I like a lot. Four Dead Ringers, Dead Slingers, Dead Gunners, Dead Eyes in the back, whatever it's called. At the front, a whole bunch of Halberds, mid-tier melee dudes. In the back, a bunch of Ice Archers. Why is this guy tiny? And then uh, a Dead Eye. Gunslinger? Ah, whatever they are. People with guns, okay? There's guns, chat. 
Ugh. What is the game? Wait, are the prediction... This is already up for this team? Okay. Sorry, predictions are already up. No, I, I can't tell you the game until it's, like, finalized and stuff. But, anyway. It's cool. I'm excited, actually. Um, the idea of people paying me money to do a thing I already want to do is pretty sweet. <clears throat> I think Blue wins this. Three, two, one. I mean, I guess, I don't know. Protectors, maybe they fall quick. The Halberds fall. Oh, Reaper slices through them. They've got to take out the Reaper fast. Reaper is super, super powerful. Wait, I mean, they're still alive, actually. Okay, these guys are working on the Pirate Queen. If these guys take out Reaper, it's possible. And they do have shots in the back. Red team could take this, dude. They've got to take out Reaper. Reaper is brutal. Oh my god. Reaper's dead! Okay, but Pirate Queen is still alive. That's bad. Pirate Queen is super powerful. And these... I don't know. These guys are probably... No, Blue's got it. Blue's got it. Okay. Good clean victory for Blue. Oh, right. There's one, <laughs> just one Hobbit over here. Oh, I thought red was the AI for some reason. Wait, blue? Wait. Oh, blue won. Okay, I mixed it up because they were on different sides. Blue wins. Congratulations. Alrighty, that's one of three. Your next contestant. Actually, no, no, no. I will very dramatically uh, reveal it. Um. Merman was a thoroughbred racehorse, one of the finest racehorses in colonial Australian racing history that raced in Europe. He won at distances from 5 furlongs to 21 halves miles. In 2016 Merman was inducted to the Australian Racing Hall of Fame. Doug, can you make us a bees with your face on it please we beg you. I don't own the... <laughs> Just because I've played a Zorbies ad a bunch on my stream does not mean I own the IP to Zorbies and can just <laughs> sell Zorbies. Okay, this, um... This looks like a tough matchup. Um, <clears throat> the next match! Glad to be watching this on my day off with Strap. Oof, sorry to hear that. Probably get better soon. The next contestant on the left, your one-time winning team, and on the right, you've got a Reaper. Sorry, you're going up against a Reaper, and you've got six Scarecrows in the Take back. as far as you recreating the Zubby Zad, I think we would be okay with you using your cut oh, some of a dog. <laughs> hobbits as well, up front. Maybe, I mean... Maybe I can reach out to the company that used to manufacture Zorbies. I literally... Barry is going to start looking into merch ideas. I, I will literally suggest to him that we... <laughs> Instead of making shirts like a normal streamer, that we try to make absorbent towels. <laughs> with... Is, I guess, like, my logo on it, or... Pirate Queen is underrated. Blue has it. Yeah. I, I could see this going either way. I think blue probably has it. The scarecrows are a little scary. They make Zorbies 3D now. They don't even have like a website though. Red wins without a doubt. I don't know, dude. Doesn't seem to be uh does not seem to be a lot of consensus on this. Let us blare Undertale music. Good luck to the Twitch chat team in three, two, one, go! Uh oh, Hobbit on Hobbit action. You hate to see it. Reaper is already killing protectors. Oh, Reaper on the right. Reaper slashes through the protectors. The front line is quickly dismantled. The Reaper on the red side. This staying alive is key to the red team's strategy. It's dead! It's dead! Okay, Scarecrows are all that's left on red team. Are Pirate Queen and Reaper alive? Are they both alive? They're both alive. They have to kill these now. 
That's it? They can auto-kill? Oh my god, that's so rigged. How do you auto-kill Scarecrow? Scarecrow's just one of the most powerful. Reaper is so rigged! He has like, on his little, on his little tentacles, he has like, $6,000 of value. That's so cheap. Alright. That's two or three. Reaper's OP, but they had a Reaper, dude. I thought Reapers, like, Scarecrows are good. Scarecrows are good. But apparently they need a lot of defense. They're glass cannons. Ah, okay. So the Scarecrows just did not have enough time. I will now... Show both teams, and as always, I will pick the harder one. You have to earn it. Two hay bellers and 44 brawlers. No, that's fucked. Okay, this one seems kind of a mess. I will just show you this as I build it. We don't need suspense. Um, let me let me get these up first before we. Uh... Before we do the prediction. Okay, five balloon on archer. This kind of feels like a mess. One, like, this team doesn't feel coherent enough to work, I don't think. Um, you got balloon archers. You do have mammoth in the middle. Ballista from the ancient. Oh, that could be that could be huge. Two halberds from the Renaissance. This is all over the place. One stoner from tribal, and one lasso from the wild west. Mm, I don't know about this team. Wait, this is only sixty-five hundred dollars. What did I miss? Oh, and three dynamite throwers from Wild West. Thirty-eight dynamite throwers. Jesus Christ! They, they just throw dynamite. What do they do? I'll put them back here. I'll spread them out a little bit more. Oh shit! Okay, I need the mammoth. This is uncomfortably quiet. I don't like it. With the fire, woo. And one hobbit? No, no, no. There's no, there's no space. Ooh. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Potentially the final round. On the left, the two-time victor. And on the right, halberds, painters, lots of dynamite throwers. I don't know how those guys work. Mammoth in the middle. Down here, you've got, what are these? Ice archers, but firework archers, I don't remember. The lasso and the ballista in the back. They throw dynamite. Yeah, but does it kill themselves? I don't know, is it is it friendly fire? Because if they just kill themselves, you removed a painter. You're right. Oops. Where, where's Painter? Wait, I should, if it's one, oh, God damn it! I'm just gonna keep spreading them out. Well, it's kinda too late now. I'll spread out a couple. I just don't know how they work. I don't wanna like rig it by Putting them in a position where they like can't succeed. Oh, I'm over. God damn it! Stop. If this single hobbit back here wins it, no, I'll put the hobbit up here. If he wins it for red team. He's the only one left, and he clutches it. I'll give 50 subs. <sighs> Do we have a prediction up? This could be the team. This could be the team that takes the $9,000 win, which is crazy. This is extremely hard to do. All right, prediction is up. Cool. <clears throat> Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Why does Blue only have 9000 Because that is the challenge. 
You have to build a team of $9,000 and beat three random ones that are more powerful. Go! The question is, how the hell does this dynamite work? Does it actually succeed in taking people out? Or do they just throw the dynamite once and then flail around meaningfully, meaninglessly? Mammoth's charging in. Dynamite's being thrown. Uh-oh. Does this kill the Pirate Queen? They're spending it on the protectors right now. They might be wasting all their firepower and protectors. Wait, it just sits there? <laughs> hey, what? What's happening? Wait, everybody's just... These guys suck ass. What a terrible unit. <laughs> they just killed themselves. Well, maybe they'll still win. Oh my sweet god. Oh my god, the ballista took him out! Okay, the ballista just had to kill the the, the guys. No. Uh, where's the hobbit? Where Where'd the hobbit go? No, that's the painter. Did anybody see the Hobbit? Why is the painter just dead up here? <laughs> Congratulations to Twitch chat. You guys actually won the challenge. This is a very, very, very hard challenge to do 9,000. Oh. Who is it again? S uh, S3N6, congratulations. Very well played. Very well played. <clears throat> I knew what that means. We move on to the ultimate challenge. <clears throat> 8,000. I don't know if 8,000 is doable. 8,000 is really hard. Easy? No, no, we're going to we're going to 8K. I think 8K is, is the super ultra hard mode. You guys have beaten normal mode. 10K versus 10K teams. You've just now beaten hard mode. $9,000 versus $10,000 teams. You're going down to only $8,000. This is ultra extreme mode. It's definitely possible. You have to get a little bit lucky on the random teams. But if you just come out with a bitchin' team, like that all cactus one, I think you can do it. It's absolutely doable. Let me update the, uh, the thing down there. We'll, uh, we'll redo the... The raffle. What's the deal with airline food? An airline meal, airline food, or in flight meal is a meal served to passengers on board a commercial airliner. These meals are prepared by specialist airline catering services and normally served to passengers using an airline service trolley. These Only $8,000? Question mark? Monka S. If you type that into the chat, then you will be entered. Just type it one time, and that is all you need to do. If you type it more than one or two times, you will actually be removed from the giveaway. Please only type this into chat if you have looked at this website or the actual game and you have a team composing of $8,000 of units. If you have all of that, then please go ahead and enter by submitting this into the chat, and then we will pick randomly. Cool, we got 330 eligible people. The average viewer earns 220 points per hour. Subs earn double points. Why am I hearing such different numbers then? I'm so confused by it. Anyway, there's a lot of money going into the Doug Doug economy every, uh... It explains all the dollar due inflation. George Washington was a war veteran and the first U.S. president. When he got elected, the first thing Sir he King did Altismo. was throw a jam sandwich in a crowd and yell, Neil Peasants. I'm not lying. True. Sir King, what is your team? I just poured water all over myself. I'm so dumb. <sighs> 
two Reapers, five Valkyries. Interesting. Leaning heavily into the Reaper strat. Jesus, take the wheel. One, two, three, four, five. The only concern with going super hard on Reapers is that every five minutes you get if, ten if you points. roll against a counter. Every fifteen minutes you get a gift thing that is fifty points. Three hundred and twenty points per hour from non subs. Increases by two tenths for tiered sub. Okay, so it's highly variable. Because it's not like everybody's sitting there getting the little uh present thing that gets them ten points or whatever. Uh, okay. I mean, Reapers are clearly very, very good. Oh, yeah, oops. Reapers are clearly very, very good. Uh, my concern is that sing like high single target damage really seems to, to fuck them. Um, so, if, for example, there's multiple Ballistas or Catapults on the right that hit the Reapers, they could die super fast. I wouldn't call them glass cannons. They are very well-made cannons, but they are cannons nonetheless. Uh, people are just typing teams into chat. That's not how this works. You have to be selected uh, from Nightbot. So this will do a giveaway if you typed in the thingy. Uh, um, alrighty. Feeling good about this. Your first contestant is... Pop lights, Berserkers, Fencers, Quick Draws. Interesting. Oh, sorry. You wanted the rest Hobbits. I got you. On the right, I will just show it this time. Um, ancient, you've got two hoplites. The bizad the cash in the trash. It's cut too true. I should reach out to Zorbies and be like, "Hey, I know you guys don't run as a company anymore, potentially, but I play your ads all the time on my stream. Like, this is just a thing. We do this constantly. Will you pay me for it?" Pretty good pitch. Four Berserkers. A Fencer from the Renaissance. And then seven Quick Draws from the Wild West. That is super, super brutal. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That is a lot of ranged firepower in the back. And they even get a Hobbit. They will pay you in Zorbies. <laughs> Do Zorbies even get sold anymore? No. No, they don't. New predictions up. You got a minute. The site is still up. Yeah, it doesn't look uh, legit at all. It looks like uh, they are going to take my cash and then put it in the trash. What's a song? What's a song? Mm, this is a song. How did you buy one then? eBay. I have an unopened box of Zorbies. I'm going to film me using them for the Billy Mays infomercial tier list video. I haven't used them yet, though. is going on here. Wait, the goddamn Reapers killed everything already. All right, they're just being shot, though. It's just a bunch of people with guns versus a skeleton. Oh, absolutely zorbed. Gunslingers are so powerful, dude. This is the thing. Reapers are not impervious. You get a couple strong shots in the back, you just get fucked, man. Fucking zorbed. I think it was a strong team. Sorry, Sir King. You went all in. Cranked up warrior. You are up next. What do you got? That was cash in the trash. A lot of people just put cash in the trash. Uh 
Oh, uh, two Ballista, three Gunslinger, rest Cactus. Okay. I like that strat. Let me move him. Lol. Damn. You don't get that many, dude. I'll give you a couple hobbits. All right. Oh, three gunslingers. So you need a couple hobbits then. Your contestant is. Ooh, that looks brutal. Two dead eyes. I'm putting them in the back. One Berserker with the Vikings. Two Flintlocks from the Pirates. One. Two. Sixteen Brawlers from the Vikings. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, and then twenty-six Blunder Buses. And you even get room for one Hobbit. All right, these are the teams. Ooh, I don't know, this looks rough. I think it's, uh, I just don't know how powerful these guys are. I mean, they do literally have guns. Guns seem pretty good. And they've got a Hobbit. The cactuses are very strong though. And then with ballistas in the back and the gunslingers, gunslingers like rip ass through all the berserkers, potentially ballistas just like fire and take out some of the people in the back. I think it's doable, dude. A lot of people betting on blue. That surprises me. I wouldn't think that blue has favored here. Cacti have done magic. I mean, I think you guys are just excited about cactuses. Wait, is it really cactuses, not cacti? I could have sworn it's cacti. This is the previous prediction. Wait, is the prediction not going? Oh, that's the previous one. It's cacti. Okay. Uh, oh my god, I can't type. No, it is. Okay, this is wait. This is one we already have. This is the right prediction. Okay, sorry, I keep I keep uh blanking. Halo theme. I can't play the Halo theme anymore. It gets muted on um, gets muted on YouTube for some reason. I don't know who's going around muting the Halo theme, but yeah, that's why I'm not using that music much anymore. Or I only use it on streams where I'm like, eh, fuck it. We'll you know, get it claimed. But <clears throat> okay, let's play the song. The question is, can the cactuses outlive the berserkers? Wow, they are doing it. The cactuses are winning. There's still a lot of fighters left on the red team, though. And they've got guns. Okay, I think they're shooting down the cactuses. Maybe not. They're being distracted by the cactuses long enough that these guys in the back are really doing work. And the ballistas as well. You still have both ballistas alive. I think Blue's got this. Wow. Well played. Strong team. That's an easy dub. <sighs> it's all thanks to the Hobbit. This one. Alright, one down. This guy, this one seems strong. This one seems really strong. I will hide the next one for dramatic effects. Uh, please be dramatized.
close the gates. <laughs> they were not open. One, two, three, four, five, six. We've also got a mammoth. Close the gates! <laughs> Two squires. This is a weird team you're going up against, chat. I wish you the best of luck. Okay, the teams are... The previous cacti gun ballista combo on the left. And on the right, you've got one mammoth. You've got a da Vinci tank. These things are crazy. If you got a real mess and want to clean like the pros, then you've got to see this. Hi, Billy Mays here with Zorbies. The most absorbent then there material are, there are I've ever used. Two berserkers it has and two squires. And the muscle. And a bomb thrower. And over 20 ounces of liquid. Look at this. Zorbies attracts liquids like a magnet. It doesn't matter if it's coffee, soda, even red wine. Watch as its powerful vacuum action pulls and cleans, cleans the stains right, right out, out of the carpet. carpet. Just that I need quick. to memorize the whole thing. The secrets in the X27 27 fiber technology. technology. Making Zorbies over 27 times more absorbent than cotton. Forget towels that just drip and unlike sponges that smell, Zorbies is odor free oh, no. and leaves a path. There we go. That's clean. path of clean. Now you can clean and dry and never leave anything behind. You'll be amazed at just how much they absorb. And they're machine washable. Dry your entire car. Even, even your, your dog. dog. Use any cleaner for streak-free windows. An average family uses up to two rolls of paper towels every week. That's, That's cash, cash in the trash. Save money and even help save the environment. You get two Jumbo Zorbies plus three extra large for only $14.99. But call right now and I'll send you another five Zorbies absolutely free. That's ten Zorbies for only $14.99. And as a special bonus, we'll also include our the Micro Men Microfiber, microfiber Duster. Duster. Free. It's great for blinds, plants, glass, and more. And attracts dust like a magnet. That's a $60 value, all for it's only $14.99. And here's the best part. We'll send you a set of Zorbies free whenever you need them for, for life. life. Just, Just by shipping, shipping and processing. But, but you, you gotta, gotta call, call now. now. I love the, um, the credits that they just show for 10 straight seconds. Man, just when I'm starting to get a little bit flaccid, it's back to full mast with the Microman microfiber duster. Uh, okay, this is what you were betting on. I don't know if you guys were paying any attention. <clears throat> Here we go. Three, two, one. If you got a real mess and want to clean like the pros, then you've got to see this. Hi, Billy, Billy Mays, Mays here with Sorbies, the, the, the most absorbent material I've ever, I've ever used. used. It has the strength <laughs> and the muscle to pick up and hold over 20 ounces of liquid. Look at this. Sorbies attracts liquid like a magnet. It doesn't matter if it's coffee, soda, even wine. Watch as its powerful vacuum action pulls and it cleans, cleans the, the stain right out of the carpet from out just of the carpet. that quick. The secret's in the X27 fiber technology, making Zorbies over 27 times more absorbent than cotton. Forget towels that just drip, and unlike sponges that smell, Zorbies is odor free and leaves a path of clean. Now you can clean and dry and never leave anything behind. You'll be amazed at just how much they absorb. And they're machine washable. Dry your entire car, even, even your, your dog. dog. Use any cleaner for streak free windows. An average family uses up to two rolls of paper towels every week. That's, That's cash in, in the, the trash. trash. Save money and even help save the environment. You get two Jumbo Zorbies plus three extra large for only $14.99. But call right, right now, now and I'll send you another five Zorbies absolutely free. That's ten Zorbies for only $14.99. And as a <gasps> special bonus, we'll also include our the Microman, Microman Microfiber, Microfiber Duster. Duster free. 
It's great for blinds, plants, glass, and more. And it cracks up like plants. a magnet. That's a $60 value, all for only $14.99. And here's the, the best, best part. part. We'll send you a yeah, set of Zorbies free. free. Whenever you yeah. need them for right. life. Just, Just pay, pay shipping, shipping and processing. processing. But, but you, you gotta, gotta call now. now. I think, um... I really gotta get to a point where I know the entire thing. I'm flying tomorrow. Maybe on the flight I'll just listen to this on loop until I can memorize- until I can recite it from memory. There was one summer where uh, we watched, this is in college, so I was like an adult, I was like 21. And uh, we were there over the summer in, uh, in Berkeley. And then for some reason we watched Cool Runnings, that old TV show, or uh, that old movie about Jamaican bobsledders. And we watched that. And we just watched it one time. It was like, we were like hungover or something. And we were just like, yeah, sure, sure, Cool, cool Runnings, whatever. And then after I after we watched it, I just went and put up a sign, just like a, a piece of printer paper. I just put up a sign on the wall and taped it there and wrote number of times we've watched Cool Runnings and put a one. And that resulted in us watching it at least every couple of days. So I memorized over that summer the first like 30 or 40 straight minutes of Cool Runnings. And it was like we watched it like 17 or 18 times, I think. It was so much Cool Runnings. So I could just watch, if I was laying in bed, I could just watch the entire movie in my head. I really need to be able to watch Zorbies at any time. Alright, mods, go ahead and time out anybody who's copy pasting. Don't, don't, I don't, I don't ever want giant paragraphs of text. That shit's annoying. Okay, for the third time. <laughs> Left team currently has one victory on the board. On the right. The newcomers. Thank you, mods. You're wonderful. I appreciate you. Here we go. The real question is going to be this fucking Da Vinci tank. This thing is brutal. They have to kill uh, Ron Da Vinci inside of the tank. If they can take him out, they're okay. But the four Jarls on the right are brutal. Oh, they're Jarls, not Berserkers. My bad. Okay, the Jarls are still alive. Mammoth is dead, it looks like. Cacti are over here, still alive. Okay, the Ballistas need to take a shot into the Jarls right now. There's only two left. They need to take out the Jarls right now. Ballistas? Whoa, they're dead! Whoa, wait, no, he's alive. Now is he dead? Wow, dude, that's insane. Okay, so we're down to two Ballistas. Are you alive? Yes, we're down to two ballistas and one gunslinger. And a cactus. Oh, and a hobbit. Wait, the hobbit could actually kill the ballista. Oh my god! Frodo! Okay, well, he took a shot for the tank. The tank maybe pulls it off now. I don't know if ballistas can take down the Da Vinci tank. I don't know. One's down! One's down! I don't think they can do it! Oh! That was super close, dude. Fucking Ronald Da Vinci, man. He is unstoppable sometimes. You need specific units to counter him. This tank is insane. Honestly, I honestly think if the Hobbit didn't take that shot, if Frodo didn't sacrifice himself for that shot here, this Ballista could have gotten a shot on Ronaldo and taken him out. I think that was really close. Yeah, Hobbit basically clutched it. Crazy. Red team wins. Sorry, Twitch chat. Yes, Cranked Up Warrior. If you type exclamation mark music, the playlist for all the songs comes up. Alrighty, well played. I think that was a very strong team. Boy, last door, you are up. What is your team? Fifty subs when? When did I promise fifty subs? I promised that if the Hobbit by himself is the only one left and clutches it. That is not what happened here. Alright, boy, last door, you got ten seconds. Okay, watches.
Just go all Huacha. King and Hobbits. Got it. Here, I'll put the king out here. Generally, generally, the mass hobbit strats have not really worked. But this time will be different for some reason. Guys, calm down about money, please. Be respectful. You get paid out at some point. I have You have to pay out the prediction in order to start a new one. You will get paid out eventually. And you will survive waiting another 45 seconds before you get your dollar dues. Hobbits are actually OP. May I please have, please have money, good sir? Yeah, see, there you go. New prediction's up. Oh, wait. Why is the prediction up? Whatever. I'll just show you who it is. <laughs> okay. Which of these seems better? 33 snake archers or 29 potion sellers? I'll do snake archers. This seems like a terrible strategy. And two hobbits. That's the team. Shitload of snake archers who literally shoot snakes. Oops. Oh, sorry. I need more hobbits over here. Oh, that was what you wanted, right? Gonna <laughs> bet against myself. <laughs> I feel like that should be illegal. Like you have to bet on your own team. They shoot snakes, that's hardcore. It's fucked up, dude. I don't even know if the snakes are agreeing to this. <clears throat> Alright. Well. I gotta be honest, I have no fucking clue who wins this. The hobbits start duking it out. And here comes the snakes. And the watch arrows. Oh god. This is a fucking Jesus Christ. <laughs> um. Okay, you've got a lot of hobbits left. I think the snakes are still fighting. Watch is coming in. Watch is taking out some archers. Wait, watch, watches are doing work. Okay, now that more snakes are coming in though. Wait, are the watches shooting at the snakes or the archers? The hobbits are actually. Wait, I think you guys are winning. I thought there was no way you beat this. Wait, the king's dead. The king is dead. Okay, now the question is, do the watches shoot at the snakes or at the archers? It all comes down to this. There aren't that many archers left. They've got to take out the hobbits first. Dude, their numbers are dwindling. You, got, you can win it. They're still dealing with hobbits. The hobbits are actually distracted. Okay. Now they're focused on watches. But there's not that many left. Wait, no. The snakes just took out one. Or did he fall apart on his own? I'm not sure. It's all down to this watcher. He's got to dodge the snakes. Oh, there's a lot of snakes coming. Oh, there's a lot of snakes. You got close, dude. That was a good one. Watches, man. Snake archers are brutal. Not really. I mean, some of the I mean sometimes, but they're not that good, really. Uh, sorry, boy, last door. Now, well, is a ghost. You are up. What is your team, my friend? How am I supposed to feed my kids now? You do not have to go all in. The same people who go, I put everything on the on the watches are the same people who turn around and then like. I'm ruined! You know what you're doing. If you put all of your wealth, all of your wealth, 
on one bet, you should expect that you might be bankrupt. This shouldn't shock you afterwards. You accidentally bet 130k on the wrong team and won. I think you're legally required to invest your winnings into Zorbies. I'm not victim blaming. I'm saying that you shouldn't act like somebody broke into your house and robbed you if you choose to put all of your money on a bunch of cactuses. It's not on me. All right. Do you have a team, Sir Ghost? Otherwise, I'm going to move on. Ten shield bearers, three scarecrows, one reaper, and 18 halflings. Okay, okay, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Three scarecrows in the back. Okay, scarecrows are glass cannons. This could work. Especially after the shields up front. One reaper. Okay, getting the reaper in is always smart. And 18 halflings. You know what? I like this. I'm going to put a couple on the side. I'm going to put a couple uh, behind them, I guess. One or two up front, just to distract. One on the sides. I'll give you as much as I can. As much distraction. I like this team. I like this team a lot. I think this is really solid. Shields up front to stall. Reaper in the back. And then Scarecrows are the glass cannon. If these guys are protected, they can dish out a lot of damage. I like it. Okay. Your... Actually, I will reveal it dramatically. Okay. I think you're going to win this one. Ladies and gentlemen, on the left is your newest Twitch chat entry. And on the right, 93 dynamite throwers. Which we saw how well that worked last time. You do have one gunslinger in the back. These guys are actually good. And, and, before you make your bet, one hobbit on Mount Olympus. Red for sure. I, I mean, red might actually win. I don't know. Like, you might be able to mass down the Reaper. Reaper can just cut through a lot of people. I honestly think red could win. I really have no clue, dude. I am going to play a brief one-minute ad and use the bathroom, though. You can just pretend the ad is Zorbies if that uh, makes it better for you. Okay. 
Ready, chat. Go! Hobbits, jump in. Oh my god, that's a lot of dynamite. Now here's the problem. They seem to have completely missed. They didn't hit the reaper. That was their only job. They're just all... <laughs> These guys are the fucking worst. <laughs> okay. It comes down to this dynamite thrower. Oh, it comes down to this hobbit. Who will win? Congratulations, Twitch chat. One win on the board. Oh, this one's weird. This is a weird team that you're going up against next. I think it'll fail? I don't know. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and then also a dead eye. I don't know. Huh. This is brutal. And two hobbits? Okay. Uh, um, next one. This, uh, this looks challenging. I'm gonna be honest with you. It is. Same winning team on the left. On the right, four bone mages. These guys have like a mid-range attack, kind of. Then 12 gunslingers. And then in the middle, on Deadeye. Plus two hobbits. So, basically a shitload of range power. But if these guys can survive and the Reaper can get back there, actual legit chance of just destroying them. I can see this going either way. My prediction is probably on red. I mean, it's just a lot of firepower. But, like, the whole point of the Protectors is just to, just to soak damage. And then Scarecrows are better against single targets, I think. I don't know, dude. I could really see this going either way. And the one the one reason I might vote blue here is blue has more hobbits. Red only has two hobbits, so you know, think about that. How do we enter? Uh, if you type the keyword, which is I forget the name of it. Only nine thousand dollars question mark monka s. If you type that into chat one time, then you will be entered. That's all you gotta do. And then I will select people randomly. I think Bone Mages destroy the Protectors. Yeah, but the Bone Mages are really weak. I don't know, yeah. I I probably Red destroys here. Red probably just absolutely annihilates them. But I think there's a chance? Let's find out. Three, two, one. Sorry, $8,000. Okay, all the Protectors are dead. That's not good. And Reaper's just being shot to hell. I mean, he's alive still. Scarecrows are- wait, this could work! Scarecrows are coming in! Scarecrows are actually taking people out! Reaper's still alive! Okay, Reaper's finally down! Scarecrows versus gun- I think Scarecrows lose here. What was that? Why did two of them just die? Wait! The crows are taking him out! Hold on! Maybe? Who gets the next shot off? That's what counts! Scarecrow's shot here, but he's- oh, he's already dead. Can they get another crow off? Oh, dude, that was close. Blue cl was really close, I think. I think you had a really solid team. I want to see if the number goes down because people are spamming it. No, not quite. Insanity is doing things. You have won. Congratulations. As a bonus, please tell me what your... Ugh, what your team is. I have lost and gained over $3 million. 
You lost in game? Wait, I don't understand. Oh, all right. That looks like a team. Good stuff. Good stuff. Let me set it up. Okay. Four monks. Front to behind. Got it. One, two, three, four. Pirate queen. Below the monks. Oh, got it. Okay. One, two, three, four. One reaper above. Five shield bearers behind the monks. Interesting strategy. One, two, three, four, five. One quick draw. Those are ninjas. Oh, oops. Dude, if you hadn't told me, <laughs> I guess chat's yelling it now. You could have just gotten a free like one thousand dollars of value. Uh, shield bearers behind the monks, and then one quick draw and one snake archer. One quick draw back here. I like the one snake archer idea. I think that's smart. Like just something to kind of get around the back back line and distract people. All right, this is your new team, Twitch chat. May they guide you to greatness. Your first opponent I will just show is... Wow, that is a lot. Farmers? One ninja, 82 farmers, one skeleton archer, 20 more farmers, so <laughs> one flintlock, five samurais, two stoners. This, uh, this random team seems like dog shit. Okay, ninja in the back. Skeleton Archer in the back. Flintlock in the back. Samurais for Dynasty. One, two, three, four, five. Two stoners from Tribal. One, two, and then the rest are farmers. This is a lot of fucking farmers. Do you have any AoE? I don't think you do. Oh wait, this is AoE. Okay. What uh <laughs> get your bets in. Are the are the is the prediction up? Or did I miss it? AoE meaning area of effect. Like he he hits a group of people. Oh, Reaper. Reaper is also Okay, prediction's up. Thank you, Mods. Reaper is also does like sweeping attacks. Oh right, Pirate Queen. I forgot Pirate Queen is here. Yeah. Okay, she drops bombs. Wait, you guys might crush this. I was thinking the far there's like too many farmers. We might absolutely destroy them. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Let us pick a song. I will pick this song. Wait, is that biased for blue, really? I think red could win it, dude. I really think red could win it. I think you're insane. Let's go. Three, two, one. The farmers come in. They start poking. They're poking and poking. The protectors are blocking, but they're starting to fall. Reaper's still alive. Pirate Queen is still alive. Those are the dangerous ones. They've got to kill Reaper, and they've got to kill Pirate Queen. Oh my god, she killed so many! Wow! Not even close. Pirate Queen is nuts, dude. Oh, she's dead! Okay, wait, so it just comes down to this guy. <laughs> nice try, buddy. Uh... Alright, solid, solid, strong opener. I think you've got a good lineup. I will hold the next one for dramatic effects.
But I don't know about this one. I honestly don't know. Um, okay. The next team is... If you got a real mess and want to clean like the pros, then you've got to see this. Hi, Billy Mays here with Zorbies, the most absorbent material I've ever used. It has the strength and the muscle to pick up and hold over 20 ounces of liquid. Look at this. Zorbies, Zorbies attracts, attracts liquids like, like a, a magnet. magnet. It doesn't matter if it's coffee, soda, even red wine. Watch as its powerful vacuum action pulls and cleans the stain from out of the carpet just that quick. The secret's in the X27 fiber oh technology, making Zorbies what a technology. over 27 times more absorbent than cotton. Forget towels that just drip, and unlike sponges that smell, Zorbees is odor free and leaves a path of clean. Now you can clean and dry and never leave anything behind. But can You'll it be clean at my just dog? How much they absorb. And they're machine washable. Dry your entire car, even your dog. Oh, thank Use God. Any cleaner for streak free windows. An average family uses up to two rolls of paper towels every week. That That's cash in, in the, the trash. trash. Save money and even help save the environment. You get two Jumbo Zorbies plus three extra large for only $14.99. But call, call right, right now, now and, and I'll, I'll send, send you another pair. Five Zorbies, five Zorbies absolutely free. That's ten Zorbies for only $14.99. And as a special bonus, we'll also include our the Micro Men Microfiber, microfiber Duster? duster? Free. It's great for blinds, plants, glass, and more. It's just and a duster, attracts right? attracts dust like a magnet. That's a $60 value, all for only $14.99. And here's the best part. We'll send you a set of Zorbies free whenever you need them for, for life. life. Just, just pay, pay shipping and processing. But, but you, you gotta, gotta call now. now. You can't afford not to buy this, Chad. All right, I think uh, mods might need to restart the prediction. I don't know if chat saw it at all. <laughs> I think they got zorbed a little bit too hard. On the left, your repeat winners. I think a strong team. On the right. Wait, do you have extra money? Oh, and two hobbits. I'll put them up here. On the right, 11 chieftains. Mid-tier, actually fairly powerful... Um, Melee units, six bomb throwers, and a Da Vinci tank. Oh, fuck. I really don't know who wins this. All right, prediction will be up in a sec. Don't worry. We were too busy Zorbin. Yeah, you guys need to start focusing. You're addicted to the Zorb. What happened to the prediction? I don't know. Maybe it got canceled or something? By the way, Asterix, thank you for the gifted sub. Appreciate it. Thank you. My stream view is blocked and can't remove it. Uh, weird. Let me try. Oops. Oop, I pulled up the wrong thing. I don't know what happened. I am able to start it. Wait. Oh, error creating. Huh? The fuck? Oh, you made it. Okay. Weird. Why do I know this music? This is from GTA 5. It's a good song. Can we beat Ronaldo? Yeah, that's the real question. The tank is just weird. You can kill him really easily, but it's hard. I, I think the Deadeye is probably good against the tank, I would guess. The Reaper? I don't know if the Reaper can get it. Pirate Queen is probably good against the tank. Literally impossible. Yeah, the Ballista is great. That's why if you can fit a Ballista, if you can fit a Ballista into your budget, it's so good for something like this, of actually uh, making sure, like, super dangerous single targets get taken out. But the Ballistas are expensive, like 900, right? Something like that. It's not easy to fit a Ballista into the budget, but Ballista is really, really good. I cl can't click on the prediction. Um, tank is too close. Well, he's sort of short range. 
Tank does friendly fire. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. All right. Sorry. It looks like the prediction is maybe having issues. Uh, you guys will uh, you will get by having a single round without being able to gamble. You'll just have to watch video games like an adult. <laughs> okay. Ready? Set. Go. Okay, Chieftain's duking it out. Chieftains seem to be falling. No, no, they're alive. Okay. We're down to just a couple Chieftains left. Chieftains are losing to the monks, it seems. Reaper and Pi- Okay, yeah, this is- They're fucked. You got them, for sure, I think. So the question is, they're gonna take out the bomb throwers. You guys still have your- Almost your entire army, basically. Like, the real heavy hitters. Wait, what? Reaper's dead? Was that from the bomb thrower here? Is it from this guy? Okay, Ronaldo's in here. You have to kill him. What was that? It's all, it's gotta be Pirate Queen. Pirate Queen's gotta do it. Is she down? Whoa, Da Vinci tank dude. Okay, both ranged units. I think I have a shot of, uh, they just have to snipe him. They just have to snipe him. Oh, in the stomach. Are you alive? He's dead. It all comes down to Snake Archer. Get a snake in there. If you get a snake in there, the snake will kill Ronaldo. Oh! No, he missed! Wait, maybe the snake's inside? Maybe the snake bounces inside the tank. Ronaldo's right there. What happens to the snake? The snake's inside? Is he gonna, is he gonna stay in or does he get flung out? He's moving in. I think the snake's attacking. Oh, he got flung out. He needs to shoot a snake directly in before he gets shot with a cannon. He's still alive. What is he looking at? Oh, the hobbits. <laughs> no, you definitely are fucked. The hobbits just came in and saved it. <laughs> a few more shots. I think snakes would have got in there. You could have snaked him. Da Vinci Tank does not always win. But you need the right tools to fight it. Congratulations, Doug. You did it! You're incredible! Great Doug. job, Doug! You're amazing! I want to be like you! Wow! Doug, that was so cool! What an amazing He's gamer the best. in person! This He's Doug the best Doug gamer! Wow! Oh my god. You're incredible, Doug! Wow! Alright, that's another loss for the Twitch chat team. Next contestant, Teen A2. I could have sworn the Da Vinci tank was shit. It's insanely good in a lot of situations. But but then it just falls apart instantly in the in the wrong ones. So they're tough. Teen A2, are you here? Chat's just saying everything is OP. Well, chat has the memory of a goldfish, so it just, whatever won most recently, they just point at that and go, ooh, that's the best, and then it just cycles. Good and evil are not allowed. We're only using uh, the default factions. If you want to make your own team, you can look at this site. This lists the 10 factions and all of their costs, so you don't have to own the game. Um, I will spam it into chat. You can just use this link. All right, I'm moving on, Mr. Tine. Exploding Yoshi, you are up. How much longer do you plan on streaming? Not that much longer, maybe like 30 minutes. Give me a sec, all right. Two Da Vinci tanks. It honestly might work. It could work. Alerts, are alerts not working? Can we just do a stream where we crash the official US dollar economy? Oh, maybe they were frozen. I'm not... Uh, that's a good idea. I don't know how that would work. Like, I don't know what that means. Because as much as I am the Federal Reserve of the Doug economy, I don't actually have the ability to print new channel points. I guess the only way I control channel points is just by, uh, streaming. That's the only thing I can do. My Prime sub didn't show up. Yeah, I guess, I guess they were paused. They, they weren't meant to be paused. The... 
I have a button that pauses or unpauses alerts, and it said that it was not paused, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure why, but sorry, I guess the alerts are going to be really behind again. Exploding Yoshi. Leave stream on 24-7. I am not incentivized to just give you guys shitloads of channel points. Like, I can set the prices for things. I can just make them cheaper if I wanted you to buy more. Ultimately, I control the levers and knobs of the Doug Doug ecosystem. Wait, you don't need to be shocked. Like, what incentive is there for me to give you more dollary dues? Uh, there are people suggesting Billy teams. Is now up in heaven, partying like it's 1999. <laughs> One bliss in the back, with two dead eyes on either side. Two yarls in the front next to each other. In the middle, put ten hay balers on the sides, flanking around the yarls. Hey Doug, can I buy your brother's oh, merch? two yarls in the front next do to each other. I have I got to it. pay shipping and processing, and do you ship to Transylvania? Uh, as long as you come and get the blood, yeah, you're good. I'll hey, ship Doug, you to my I'm hungry. apartment. What should I eat for dinner? Please give a good suggestion or my wife is going to divorce me. Cabbage. All cabbage. All right. Exploding Yoshi is pulling out the Ballista. I think that is a, a smart thing to have in the repertoire. Where the hell is Ballista? You look kind of sad, so here you go. It would have gone to rent, but we'll probably not be able to pay it this month either. <laughs> Wish me luck. <laughs> okay. Good luck. I am... There we go. I'm done. Ballista back here. Two dead eyes on either side. Two Jarls in the front. Ten hay balers on either side. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, do you want ten? Ten hay balers total on the sides? You can't afford ten more, can you? One, two, three, four. Inspire bot. Compassion is for okay. Yeah, so that's that's all you got, and then the rest is hobbits, right? Cover the front of the Jarls with halflings. Shit, I don't have space. Doug, technically we pay you to do things you want to do long. I mean, not really. I guess, yeah, I guess, that's true. Hey Doug, can you give us your Zubby's code? It would be really nice if you did. If anybody, if there's an email for Zorbies, if somebody can find an email, I'll email them and ask if they'll sponsor me and I can get a, a Clean code. your computer instead of a dog if you do the commercial. Get it wet and Zorb it. I feel like I'll break my computer if I Zorb it too hard. Alright, on the left. Hay balers, who are kind of like, uh, have a shield basically of hay. Two Jarls, bunch of hobbits with them. Ballista in the back. Two dead eyes. I think it's a well-rounded team. I really like it. I will just show you the first contestant. Four halberds, melee guys. One king, another melee guy. One captain, another mid-range. Eight cactuses, from the potion seller, firework archers, quick draw. This is a, this is a rough team. They are marine animals with a leathery a skin team. and an elongated body containing a single branched gonad. See cucumbers are found on the sea floor worldwide. One captain, eight cactuses. Ooh. One, two, In three, Domin's four. Magnifico, Eneratus non palimet sominus en famil. Bless you all and let the Reaper do his work. Potion seller. Two firework archers, dynasty. One, two, and one quick draw Your from Wild West. Your department should research how to bring Billy Mays back to life. And I'll put some hobbits back here. That is a brutal team on the right. Get your bets in. There's a lot of melee Doug, firepower. Doug, give me my children There's a lot of range firepower. I gave firepower. you all of my US dollar reduce. Fine. Um, I put the secret... I put your children's location encoded in the Jesus, DNA of the my wheel. blood. <laughs> Come find it. DT Banshee, thank you for the five gifted subs. For five more. Appreciate it very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
It's a treasure hunt. Find your children. Hey, Doug, All in on the cash. Watching this at work. I mean, oh no, my boss Blue is, is good. coming. Quick, act like you're working. <laughs> what does it? Um. Might as well make it one hundred and fifty dollars. I'm living on a street now. Found a cozy box though. How are those reports coming along? Okay, they bought it. Uh, I think Blue can do this. If Blue, here's what I'll say. If if Blue can beat this team, they have a real shot at winning all three. This is hard as fuck. Bam. Ready? Set. Go! Every morning I wake up and I flail meaningfully. Okay. Jarl on the left doing a good job of keeping himself alive. That gives time for the ballistas and the dead eyes back here to just keep roping damage in. Over on red. They still have cactuses and halberds. The starting to drag on because you were so fake. Jarl still alive in the middle. The longer they can stall, the better this is. Jarls are both alive right now. Doug, can you do a stream where you buy the John Deere wireless gaming mouse? Uh-oh. I don't know what that is. Jarl is still alive. Jarl's dead. Eight K maybe. Oh hard, my god! But so am I. Is this guy dead? He's going so far. He's dead, he's dead. Ballista needs to get another shot on the king, probably. Now he's dead. Sexy, also known as X, was a Phoenician colony at the present-day site of Alamampar on southeastern Spain's Mediterranean coast. The Roman Rough. name for the place was Sexy Firmum Iulium. Alternative transcriptions of the Phoenician name of the city in Latin include Sex. I think it was a great team. I think it was a great team. Just a very, very brutal opponent. Roic here? You are up. You win. Congratulations. What do you got? Uh, never underestimate the power of Cacti. Red team had 9,700. I thought I put a bunch of hobbits in. Oh, well. They still won. Doesn't matter. Right here, are you here? How are your stocks doing? Good question. How are the stocks doing? We have a... Uh, it's been, I think, nine months. Over nine months. It's been nine and a half months. Uh, let's take a look. How are these going? Okay. Do For people backflip. have been paying attention to the economy. It's been bad. These are the $10,000 in stocks that Parkser and I purchased in January, um, as chosen by you guys. Parkser has lost money on almost everything, but has gained $40 on waste management and $25 on Walmart. In total, he has lost $1,721. Meanwhile... <laughs> okay, Pe Pepsi did make us $7.5, so that's nice. Costco, my boys, made us 20 bucks. However, Aspen Aerogels, that suggestion, has currently gone down 60% in value. I remember when people suggested this initially, and I was like, I don't know what this is, but the only reason somebody would suggest this is if they're sure it's going to be awesome. CRISPR is down 8%. That's not too bad. Hasbro is down 34%. Intel is down 47%. NVIDIA is down 43. Intel and NVIDIA, I thought, were like, Ultra safe, and they just absolutely porked us. And Sony is porking us pretty hard too. Minus four fifty. Nvidia and Sony alone are like a negative a thousand. Damn, we got absolutely roasted on those because of chip shortage. Oh, okay, well if they fix the chip shortage in the next three months, we're good. <laughs> yes, yeah, because Adriac left Nvidia. Um. Yeah. So currently uh, we've lost me twenty six hundred dollars. So that's cool. 
I did say for people who weren't here, because we did this last, not, uh, yeah, we did this in January. So about nine months ago, mid-January. And it was Twitch chat invest $10,000 in the stock market. And then Parkser agreed to also invest $10,000 and see if we could beat him. We did, coincidentally, invest $10,000 right before a recession. So it's a little unfair. But I did give the context that the reason I even did this is because I invested $500 in Dogecoin and then ended up making $3,500 from it. I sold Dogecoin at its highest ever peak and just made $3,500. So I figured as long as, because that's just like meme profit. So I figured as long as you guys don't lose me more than $3,500, I'm fine. And you're actually close to losing me. <laughs> if you go down another thousand, I will actually be negative after Dogecoin plus Twitch chat investing. I didn't think you would actually drop this much. So, uh, so this is going great. Stocks are crushing it. Parks are really called this out correctly. He hedged a little bit better. Can somebody, if somebody has extra chips and could send them to Intel and NVIDIA, that would be great. Because just those two are costing us like $900. Should have invested in Pfizer. These are all your guys' suggestions. This is not on me. And you voted whether or not we invested in them. Somebody go jam a bunch of tortilla chips into Intel. Oh, sorry. I got you now. All right, next contestant is... One, two, three, four, five squires. A dragon. We haven't seen a dragon in a little bit. Two reapers. I'll put them over here on the sides. Six flintlocks. One, two, three, four, five, six. One ballista. Math is good. I like that team. That's a, that's a good, solid team. Nice little front line. Reapers will hold, and then Dragon burns down the middle. I think that's solid. I think it's a good shot. Your contestants are... Firework Archer, Clubber, two Flintlocks, one Miner, and 62 Fencers. Hi, guys. You won't believe this. I think you can beat that. When I was zooming out of the school, I found some cash in the trash. Now I can finally divorce my weird uncle. I thought you were going to do a Fresh Prince of Bel-Air adaptation, but all Zorbing. Alrighty. Um, we've got a Miner. We've got a Clubber. We've got two Flintlocks. That's the third prediction in a row that haven't shown up. I, I don't know what's going on. It seems like predictions might just be having an issue. And then 62 fencers. What a fucking team. And they get one it's hobbit. Cactus-y. They work fine. People are saying try refreshing. Try refreshing and the predictions might start working again. All right, the prediction is up. Thank you again to the mods for running the predictions. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. On the right team, you have a shitload of fencers. You've also got one miner. There's a clubber in there. You've got two flintlocks and you've got one firework archer. Basically, a lot of weak units is what you're working with. On the other side, exact opposite. You have a couple fairly weak frontliners, fairly weak gunsmen. The two reapers, you put a, most of your money into that. Dragon in the back can burn through people. Basically a glass cannon. And then Ballista back here. It's just going to shoot through. I think Dragon and Reaper should clean this up pretty easy. So I think this is a nice safe bet for blue team. All right. What's a good song? Um... Hello, I'm casting a spell on you. Hippity hoo, hippity hey, you're all breathing manually. Oh, 
Oh, this song takes like 30 That's minutes to drop. That's the fourth prediction that didn't show anyone else having the same problem. Good news about that, though, is you can just tell people you would have bet for the winning team. They can't call you out on it. That is a lot of fencers. The question is, hey, Doc, did you hear can they win through sheer numbers? Fucking roasted me. That was not even remotely close. Oh, it all comes down to this Hobbit. If he wins 1,000 gifted subs, go Frodo! You can do it! Congratulations, Twitch chat. That's one of three wins done. Doug, I just right, found right, right. out Let's that Billy going. died in 2009. Can we get F in the chat? Yeah, no, Bill, Billy's been dead the whole time that we've been zorbing. I really, I really do love Billy. Hope he's resting peacefully. All right, nice job. Two more contestants. I will reveal them dramatically. Oh, shit. This is doable. This looks doable to me. This looks doable to me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I mean, it's still tough, uh, huh. but way more doable. Sea cucumbers are echinoderms from the class Holothuroidea. They are marine animals with a leathery skin and an elongated body containing a single, branched gonad. My wife left me for a sea cucumber. Thank you. Unsubscribe from Sea Cucumber Facts. To call now, but there isn't a phone number anywhere in the commercial. How am I supposed to call now? Just Billy? pick one. There's no time to figure it out. Your new challenger is 78 hobbits plus 14 berserkers who will jump into the back line. Plus one squire. This dude's very weak. One gun. Uh, oh no, dead eye. One dead eye back here. So she's a single sh single target shot. And a king, who's a quite beefy melee unit. Basically, big army of melee dudes. I could really see this going either way. You've got the dragon to burn down. You've got reaper to work on AoE. You don't have that much backline damage. I guess you don't... Won't survive. This I'm team also doesn't dying. have... Don't do this to me. I deserve better. You're talking about one of the teams? The alerts are delayed, so I'm trying to imagine what team you were Sorry, referring to. Sorry, I have to. to leave for an hour for therapy, but to back my liege. Welcome back. All right, what are people saying? I'm curious. What, where's the belief? Okay. Wait, really? Four million on blue team? Uh, that seems insane. I am- am I crazy here? I feel like red has a strong chance. Depends how long the dragon stays alive. Yeah, I mean, dragon could burn through a lot of them. I guess- yeah, and- and hobbits aren't good at clearing reapers. I'm broke now and sad. The streets will hopefully treat me well. <laughs> Thank you, DT. <laughs> Go find a hobbit. They'll take care of you. Ready. Set. Go. Reaper's working through. Wait, there's already a lot of dead hobbits. The Berserkers have cut down the dragon. I repeat, the Berserkers have cut down the dragon. They've got to take down this Reaper. They've got to take down both Reapers. They still have the King. King's working on Reaper. He can stall while the Berserkers... Where are the Berserkers? They're stuck back here. They just got reaped. King has to do work here. It's so loud. He's dead! 
King is dead. Wow, you took it. Whoa! Dad, I took out a Reaper! I don't know how hurt this Reaper is. This dead eye could take him out! Can she get another shot off? Oh no! She was loading the gun, dude! That could have been it! Super close fight! Dead eye super OP against Reaper, apparently. Damn! Okay, you guys barely clutched that shit out. I don't know why that was such a one-sided bet. It's cactopodes, not cacti. No, it's not. Uh, that's two wins. You could actually pull off the $8,000 challenge. Last one. Jordan Luke, thank you very much for the 12 months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm trying to pick the harder of the two teams. I always do this for final fight. Both of these look beatable. I'm going to hide it. Okay. Hey, Doug. That last prediction bam kept me, so I will be needing my old job but making your merch in your basement back, please. Fine. Uh oh, he's waste there the random inputs wasting money on a jouster. That's good for you. And then lot of money. Hobbits. Ladies and gentlemen, the potential final fight. The final round for the $8,000 challenge. On the left, your two time victor. And on the right, you are looking at 21 monks. 21 monks. These are mid tier melee units. You've also got a Minotaur. You've got two harvesters in the back. You've got a harpooner. You've got a jouster. You've got one balloon archer. Yeah, one balloon archer. Two hobbits. And then I think there's a hobbit up here. Yeah, there's one hobbit up here. Biased more like based. This seems doable. This seems doable for blue, dude. I think the Reapers can crush it. There's just not enough ranged firepower on red side. And this is me picking both of them. Are the monks powerful enough to overcome the Reaper's AoE attacks? They're whacking. They're whacking and attacking. Dragon is what is going on here. Dragon is floating around going for the... Oh, he got Harpoon. He got Pooned. Okay, the dragon's been Pooned away from the main army. The monks are currently spread out, attempting to fight. Minotaur went and took out the Ballista. Wow. Okay, Minotaur went for the back line. It's all going to come down. Looks like these guys are blowing up. Are they alive? I don't know what's going on here. It's all going to come down to the Reapers. Can they take out the Reapers? Oh my god, the Reapers are insane. But the monks are living. The dragons are alive! 
Monks are working on the dragons now. Okay, the dragon is dead. Hey, first ever Minotaur's charging. Twitch, though you'd be a good one. It's like 10 p.m. for me and I've got some bad cards slash headache, so thanks for making such great content. Hey, it thanks! Still make me laugh. Can Minotaur do it? He's alive. Minotaur's got to charge in. That doesn't kill! He needed- Oh my god, he needed that to kill. Minotaur's still alive. He can get one more charge in. Charges the wrong people. Goes in for the Reaper attack. And he's dead. Who's left? Are one of these guys alive? Huh? Where's the Hobbit? The Hobbit's still alive? The end of the map? The hell? There's people down here? Are you alive? Mick, Mick, thank you for the 12 months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Is he like falling to his death down here? Where is it? Where's the Hobbit? Fokra Dian. Tabs Yar, I think. It's this guy. This guy's alive. I think I might be able to take control of him. Alright, you got this, buddy. Let's get you out of here. Um... Oh! Press the wrong button. Technically, you didn't win. We go again. You need to fucking win. I'm not giving you this unless you actually win. Wait, they already took out Dragon! Wait, this could be different! Holy shit, wait, what? I mean, it's, it's gotta come down to the Reapers, right? If the Reapers can can hold them, then you're good. This dude just harpooned this random poor guy. Okay. The Minotaur's actually focusing on the Reaper this time. The Jouster's going for the Ballista! The Jouster took out the Ballista! Okay, the Jouster's still alive! And the Minotaur's alive! This could go either way! The Reapers are dead! Oh my god, they're doing it! <laughs> Red wins! Red wins! And they wasn't even close! Okay. We the only the only option that makes sense here. Wait, did you already pay out? Uh oh. I was gonna say best two out of three. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> um. Best two out of three. Two out of three. The, let's do another prediction. I mean, technically, red team won first. That that prediction is technically correct. One more prediction. Best of three battle. 
Blue didn't win one. Exactly. Well, this is the one that will determine if Twitch chat's team won. If Twitch chat's team won with $8,000 three times. There was a clear winner. I got to go off the win. Um. <clears throat> I can't refund the money, so all we can do is move forward into this best of three. The predictions are live. It looks like it's 50-50 this time. I don't understand how it's so one-sided. You press the button. It didn't end. I didn't, I didn't press the prediction button. I ended the, the match early because it was clearly stuck. Well, it's because I accidentally pressed the wrong button, but it was clearly stuck. It depends on the dragon. Mm, I think it's all about the dragon. Yeah. <clears throat> Best two out of three. You're lousy. How dare you talk to the dragon that way? In three, two, one. About 50-50 split on this one. Comes down to these. If they can stay alive. And they'll crush it. Dragon's moving through. Is being beaten up by the monks, but they are still holding. Minotaur's in the back line. Is not seeming to focus on the right people this time. What the hell is the ballista aiming at? Oh, this guy. Looks like blue. Blue's to a little better side. Dragon finally falls, but Reaper's got to get some kills this time, and... Oh, Minotaur took out Ballista. You have both Reapers up. The Jouster died early on. Reapers are working on it. Minotaur stuck behind the Ballista. Minotaur stuck. Oh no. Okay, finally it's over. That was a whole mischarge opportunity. If he charges in, takes it. Okay, headbutt to Reaper. Reaper's clearing out. You still got both. This guy has to do it. This guy has to do it. Minotaur, it's up to you. He readies the charge. He can maybe hit both. Oh, he hits one! Wait! Let's go out of the way! Reaper is still alive, but probably not by much. There seem to be two monks and one Minotaur. Is he going to let him charge? He lets him charge! The charge doesn't kill! Reaper attacks back! Kills Minotaur! Oh my god, that guy is so dead. Jesus Christ. He's not even dead! He's still alive! He's just falling to his death! Reaper's the only one left. Two monks. Two monks are left. The monk is... Oh, this is a harvester. The harvester is stuck on the column. Oh! Harvester! Get unstuck, harvester! You can do it! You can do it! Oh! Close fight, dude. This is so even. Blue team takes it. And the best of three, Twitch chat definitively, unquestioningly, wins against three $10,000 random teams. Very well played. Very, very well played. What a combo, dude. The dragon. The dragon worked out. Or still one one. You're lousy. I think it's definitely two one on blue. I realize I'm using different metrics for what winning means, but okay, we'll do we'll do one more. No prediction on this one. Twitch chat wins. This is a bonus round. If blue wins again, I'll give five subs. Ready, set, go. Depending on whether you think the first round was real or not, this is the best of three. This isn't for dollar dues. This is just for Doug's hard-earned money. 
Oh, Jouster gets in there. Jouster gets in. It takes out the dragon immediately and is then whacked. Harvester's doing work. What does the Minotaur do? Bliss is still in the back. Bliss needs to focus on the Minotaur. Instead, he's focusing on the monks. Okay, he's focusing on the monks. Reapers are working through. Is Minotaur alive? Minotaur's still alive. Reapers are crushing it. Reapers are playing super well right now. No, they're not even letting people get close. And you still have Ballistas in the back. Ballistas? Wait! Did the Ballistas just kill your own Reaper? What? Uh-oh. Charged by Minotaur. And he's pooned! He's pooned! Wow! Gets a hit in while being pooned backwards. Continues to take out Monks. The Ballista! The Ballista's shooting at the Hobbits! No! Reaper in the back. Still fighting. Takes out another. Can the Hobbit? The Hobbit might actually take out the Ballista. That's right where the bolt comes out, buddy. You don't want to be there. Wait. He baited it! The Hobbits are genius! Over here, Reaper's alive! Minotaur appears to be dead! Last Mark has fallen! Wow, the Ballista! The Ballista survives! The Hobbit! He's just kind of holding onto the front! Oh my god! The Hobbit Strat! You're fucked, Jet! Oh! Blue Team takes it! Congratulations, Doug! You did it! You're incredible, Doug! Job, Doug. You're amazing. That's two out of three, wow. arguably so three out of four. Twitch chat's team fucking game. crushed wow. it. What oh a play! God. Well done. Doug. Sixty-one expired trademarks to include the bees and the bees 3D. <laughs> okay, noted. Who submitted that winning team? Roy, congratulations. Recently Very well played. Your video and I was wondering if you ever got tested for sleep apnea. I did. I do have sleep apnea. But I don't really. I hope that helps. <laughs> um, hold on, let me uh, pay out. Durgish Shitner Zoller. Thank you very much for five good subs. Appreciate it. I will also get five. Let me gift some subs. What were the past two songs? This is Damon X Machina, main theme. Two songs. This is Damon X. Uh -oh. Often informally called sea scorpions, are a group of extinct arthropods that form the order Eurypterida. The earliest known Eurypterids date to the Darwinian stage of the Ordovician period 467.3 million years ago. The group is likely... Wanna hear a dirty joke? A man fell in mud. Wanna hear a clean joke? He took a bath with Bubbles. Wanna hear a dirty joke? Bubbles was the girl next door. <laughs> in West Philadelphia's have been away. On the playground is where I zorbed. Most of my days. That's so true, dude. Really? You guys have spent millions of dollars on Zorby's ad? And then you can't even afford one laugh track? Okay, fine. Um, hey! Well played, chat. You really crushed it today. Uh, last time when we did this, your armies were uh, hot diarrhea. <laughs> and today, these were like competent, well-thought-out teams. This is a hard-ass challenge. You guys did it. Well played. Well played. Maybe we'll yearn for the fabled $7,500. I'm going to call it for today. Um, a shorter stream. i got to do some other stuff. Thank you. Thank you. I do try. When next Mario Party stream? I don't know. Sorry, I don't really plan stuff in advance that much. I just kind of hey, think of what sounds design, interesting. Hey, priest of yeast himself here to tell you to erect a shrine in my honor for in return I shall cure hunger. Uh, your shrine will be the Minotaur that we sent over the edge of the, uh, the planet. Can you still make D&D? &D? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's why I'm ending a little <laughs> earlier. Also, I'm just a little tired today.
Next AI invasion should be Pangea. The next AI invasion will probably be a zoo. That will... I'm just, I'm traveling the next two weeks, which is tough. And AI invasion streams are just very long and draining. I like them a lot, but it's hard to do it when I have other obligations. Was delayed. <clears throat> and they can go for seven hours, whatever they've been. Um, did you stop the if I say that something happens for a specific reason? No, I just... I have a shitload of things I could do at any given time. I just do what I think is interesting. That idea feels a little played out to me right now. Uh, Sir Cotswold, thank you so much for the 12 months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, mods, can we get a prediction of... Because we, I think the alerts are a little bit behind, so I'll, I'll let those play out. Um, do I flip heads two times in a row? A lot of people are saying they lost all their money today. Here's how you get it back. You bet yes. You believe. Don't forget to throw. Don't forget to throw food down in the basement before you leave. No, no, no. I'm somebody. I'm having somebody come by the place, and they'll throw food down there while I'm gone. All right, predictions up. Uh, why am I playing this music before I've even flipped? Where team cowards and blue teams might by hiding in the map rigged be z z z z z z I like the idea that you guys buzz angrily when when things don't go your way. Okay, <clears throat> now I will play. Uh, Jesus, the, take the, the wheel. Song. You know, what? I'm gonna play the the sexy song instead. Durga Shitner's all earth. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you again very much for the five minutes subs. Appreciate it. Uh, here you go. <laughs> I gotta wait till the prediction's over. Three, two. Jesus, take the wheel. Ooh. Well, I guess run it back. Someday you'll get the name right. I believe in you, Doug Pride Heart, the Pride Heart. Dersha sh shit in the Zoller. That would be it. All my ancestors are German. I have to know German. It's extinctual at this point. Ha 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 ha. Oh, I have to wait a minute. You said I would get it all back. Vote, vote, believe this time. Believe this time. This will, it'll happen. I have nothing to bet. You gained 40,000 points today. That's almost 10% of his Orbeez had. Doug. Just give it a minute. It's coming. <laughs> okay. Yeah, sometimes you really got to warm it up. I lost everything believing in you. Ah, uh, no, you'll be fine. Okay, wait. Is the prediction over? Prediction's over, right? <clears throat> Do I get heads twice in a row? Ow. Marktrack.mp3. I'm sorry, I'm poor. Ha 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 ha. Ah, shit is tail. Sorry, guys. Okay, it's gotta be the next one's gotta be it. This is where you make all your money back, dude. Go, you gotta believe. Believe in this one. Mods, do a, do a prediction just 30 seconds this time. 30 seconds, let's let, let's let's jam it. I think the, the things are almost caught up. You gotta believe. It's this is simple math. You got like I took a stats class in college. It's a 50-50 chance it'll happen this time because we missed the last two. Um either it happens or it doesn't. Um <clears throat> It's my last $50 reduce. Put them in. You're going to get so much money from that. That's not how probability works. No, no, no. My mom's a doctor. I think I know what I'm talking about. <clears throat> First one. Wait, is it still going? No, that's getting paid out. Oh, fuck. Okay, so now that it's now that the first one was heads, that means it's a 25% chance for this one to be heads. Uh, 
Oops. Oh, double heads, let's go! Yeah! Everybody wins! I did it. Twitch chat saved! Doug would never lie to us about anything. We did it, guys! We did it! I told you, dude. We won the 50 50. All right, cool. Gran Turismo music has no business being this good. So true. It's so fucking good. Man has never been to statistics school in his life. Uh, statistically, there's a 50% chance I took a stats class in college because it was optional in my major. Checkmate. I used all my dollar readers on the last bet and I couldn't be like Duke Doug Claude. That's why you always have to save one more point in the tank. For believing. Are oh, you getting an ad? One more Zorbin time. You want to? If you want to shoot for Zorb, if anybody won enough money. Jokes on you! I didn't get any ads. I don't understand how it works. Twenty percent of our way to Zorbies. That's how stats works. You're now 20% of the way there. All right, our people's ads are over. Okay, I'm going to raid Monterey Bay Aquarium. Hey, Doug, it's my birthday, so all my wishes have to come through. So I will always believe. Yeah. It happened. Happy birthday. I'm going to raid Monterey Bay Aquarium. Go enjoy some wonderful sea otter... Video? Uh, I am going to Monterey Bay Aquarium this weekend. I'm excited about it. I will not be streaming uh, the next couple days because I will be traveling, but I will stream either Monday or Tuesday next week, and I will review the trip and show the pictures and videos I took, as well as play the Otter game on Steam that I mentioned, as well as I should have the uh, Temp Tattoos at that point. We will do a big otter day next week on either Monday or Tuesday. And then um, and then after that, I'm traveling more, so I'll probably only stream one day next week. Then the following I'm traveling. Oh, wait. Oh, God damn it, the raid didn't happen. Wait, did the raid happen? Did the raid happen? Are you here? Are you here? Where are you? Are you here or there? I think it timed out. Oops. Heads. Okay, bye!